I have returned. Sorry about that. Oh, wow. Ah, uh, Death's just got here fucking obliterated. Okay, just checking. My children in this place. Yeah. Fucking prison cells. screamed at them for hours and they always ignored me oh that's absolutely fucking horrific <sighs> I must have come through here when it broke out but I don't remember it this is a bad place yeah. This is basically where I can I could tell that Jack would face fucking torture. Entry ten fifty four Telton facility. The latest iteration of Pergnum went poorly. Subjects one, four, and six died. No biotic change among the survivors. We lowered core temperatures of surviving subjects, but no biotically beneficial reactions occurred. As a side effect, all subjects died. So we'll not try that on zero. I hope our supply of biotic potential subjects holds up. We are going through them fast. This is bullshit. They weren't experimenting on the other children for my safety. You can't help what they did to others. You don't get it, Shepard. I survived this place because I was tougher than the rest. That's who I am. You move on, harder and tougher. Uh, yep. Okay, and then... Oh, I caught that one, barely. It should be like a biotic upgrade, probably. This should come in handy. Yep. Oh boy. Oh, I am all sorts of nasty. Oh boy. Hey, friends. Hey, Arash. It's Kira. Yeah, the intruders are here. You want them dead? We have to talk Chris. I promised that plot to salvage, but this place is a waste. Fine, we'll put him down. But I'm coming in there and we're gonna talk salvage. What are you doing here? First, we're gonna kill you. Then, we'll see. Kill them on my own. I want them dead. Oh. 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 Out. Push and overrun. That's a really bad idea when you have as many biotics. Okay. On my way. I've got your back.
Red. Head. Only room left is my old cell. Whoever Aresh is, he's in there. I want to plant the bomb there anyway. Might as well do it on his corpse. I get her logic with that. There we go. Okay, I'm gonna save just come out. We know you're here. Oh, you with who the... are you? My name is Aresh, and you're breaking into my home. I know you, Subject Zero. So many years have passed. She's about to put a fucking bullet in your head. I'm not going to stop her. How the hell do you know me? We all knew your face, Jack. They inflicted horrors on us so their experiments wouldn't kill you. You were the question, and I'm still looking for the answer. Looks like you're not the only one pulled back here, Jack. I tried to forget this. Oh, he was, was another like experiment. It doesn't forget you. It follows you. I hired these mercs and came back almost a solar year ago. We're rebuilding it piece by piece. I'm gonna find out what they knew. How to unlock true biotic potential in humans. I'm restarting the Telton facility. It will be beautiful. Can I just- I wanted a hole in the ground. He's trying to justify what happened by using it? You do the same thing to new kids. Wasn't this forced on you? Some were bought from poor families on Earth, or kidnapped from colonies. Most ended up here the way I did. Batarian pirates. They did such horrible things to us. They must have had good reasons. No! There's no reason good enough! Are you nuts? You lived it! We can blow up the place, but that still leaves him. What do we do with another you? That's easy. Just leave me here. This is where I belong. Fuck that. Jack, he's trapped in his past. You need to move on from yours. He wants to restart this place. He needs to die. He's crazy and he's never going to restart this facility. You have to let it go. Your past doesn't have to control you. Fuck. Get out of here. Go. He's not worth chasing. None of it is. You did the right thing, Jack. Maybe. This room was my whole childhood. Give me a minute to look around. Go ahead. Nothing's changed. But it's all different. I used this table for everything. It was like my best friend. I'd crawl under it to cry. I was pathetic. No, you weren't. We're a fucking kid. Sometimes I dream that I'm back in this bed being tortured. I used to tie the sheets around my wrists and try to rip them off. I want to stop coming back here. See the scarring on the wall here? That's where I killed my first man. One of the guards tried to stop me. Instead, I stopped him. 
Uh, I thought that room out there was the rest of the world. I pound and yell. Never did me good. Okay, no more wallowing. Let's blow this place to hell. Yeah, I'm all for that. Good shit. Ooh. Disagreement? Can you head it off before they tear out a bulkhead? I'll deal with it. Take pictures. <laughs> Touch me and I will smear the world with you, bitch. Enough. Stand down, both of you. The cheerleader won't admit what Cerberus did to me was wrong. It wasn't Cerberus. Not really. But clearly you were a mistake. Screw you! You've got no idea what they put me through. Maybe it's time I showed you. Our mission is too important to let personal feelings get in the way. Fuck your feelings. I just want her dead. You both know what we're up against. Save your anger for the Collectors. I can put aside my differences until the mission's over. Sure, I'll do my part. I'd hate to see her die before I get a chance to fillet her myself. You two gonna be okay? It's a good thing you came by when you did. As long as she does her job, we'll be fine. Thanks, Shepard. Okay. Oh boy. Okay, the only reason I even did that is because my Paragon is maxed. Uh. Oh, crippling. Crippling, yeah. Eight seconds? Uh then basically they don't trust you and you can't get the best upgrades. Also, Miranda, your bed's nicer than mine. What the fuck? Hey. Thanks again, Shepard. Taking the time to help me with my sister. I couldn't have reached Oriana in time without your help. That's what I do. I'm glad Niket tried to redeem himself for what good it did. Thank you for stopping me, Commander. Sounds like you had a soft spot for Niket after all. I didn't have many friends. Niket was one of them. He never wanted anything from me. He was safe, comfortable. A reminder of a more innocent time, I suppose. Let me know if I can do anything else. Oh? I think I got it from here. My father has no chance at finding her family in their new location. But thank you, Commander. My oh. sister is safe again, thanks in large part to you. I won't forget that. It's what I do. Okay, that. I mean, thinks if I talk to her one more time, I'm gonna get some Miranda booty but I don't know if uh, she's exactly you know if she swings uh, that way I'm gonna go talk to, uh, I gotta go talk to Jack and Grunt actually and Morden
Ow. Hey, what's going on, big guy? Bird not grunt. I like it. I have a clan. That makes me. It makes me want to fight, not just able to. Hey. At Uvink, I wanted to disembowel him, to tear out his spine like a trophy. We started this because you were losing control. Now you sound more violent than ever. Rex said I was normal. Just had this built up stuff because of being grown in the tank. Now that I know it's not an outside thing, and I have a place as a Krogan, I like it. Our enemies are in trouble, Shepard, and we better not run out of targets. There's no danger of that. They're practically lining up. Everyone gets a turn. Ha! <laughs> Wouldn't want it any other way. I don't know if you can fuck the Krogan. But yeah. Like. Think. Legit. Okay. Next one. Probably going to be more incendiary ammo. Oh, hey. Hey, Zaid. The Eid. I want to go down here. Talk to Jack, see how she's doing. Hey. I needed to wipe that place off the map. You took me there to do it, and I owe you. That's what I do. You don't know what it's like, Shepard. To have garbage like that following you, it marks you in ways you, you don't expect. I've made a lot of hard choices, Jack. Like what to let go. Hard to walk away from it. You'd think it would get easier now that the place is a crater. But what else do I know? I never thought I'd see you show mercy, but you let Aresh live. He was trapped in the past, reliving it every day. You showed how that could be me. I'm not getting stuck like that. I'm better than him, and I'm sure as hell not carrying that crater around with me. Do you think you're different now? I know that place is gone. But I still kind of want to kill every person I see. No offense. You sure about this? I want to do whatever I can to get your head on straight. Don't get all therapist on me, Shepard. You're not the couch type. I hate that stuff anyway. Bullshit prison psych. You did me a favor, and that's enough. More than I expected. I'll keep it together. Good shit. I think I have a lot of romance options. Fuck. Okay, talk. But I still have more loyalty missions to do. Because I still need to do Thanes, I still need to do Tallies. I've done Garrus's, I still need to do Samara's, and Thanes, Jacob's, and I. Oh, yeah, I need to go talk to Morden. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. Heard not dark. Oh, ooh, nice. So check to biotic boots. Uh jacket. Uh definitely. Grind gets a claim heavy shotgun. If only it didn't cost platinum. <sighs> And yeah, I'll I'll take that fucking Morton. Still hard to believe Malin betrayed me, betrayed my work, disgusted by his actions. Proud of his nerve, though. Always thought he lacked backbone. Ho 
hope you find something new. Better goal, better purpose. Fewer torture tests. <laughs> what about Malin's data on the genophage? His attempts at a cure. What about it? Have it over there somewhere. Not dealing with it now. Need to focus on collectors. Not important now, regardless. Appreciate you helping me back on Tachanka. Should get back to work. Wasted enough time already. Lots to do. Talk later. Yeah, sure. Where do I get a skin wave? Can you romance multiple? All right, well, I need to go to Omega anyway. Oh, did I already hit up in there? No, I did not. Yes. Oh, I know what I can afford. There we go. Oh, another one rips. Yes. All that platinum for me. With the uh, well, first first action. Lorek and Dorgal. Megan Neb. All 
right. Here we go. I'll take the iridium. There we go. All right. One second. There we go. All right. I'm going to... I don't know. Oh, I like that one. Covering Jack and... I'll bring Jack and Garrus. We go. Let's 
Cerberus Cajun. All right. Glad I checked. Money, money, money. Get the money. I don't need more Paragon points. I'm literally already perfect Paragon. Not how morality works. In games, it is. Because in games, it is a binary choice. Probe. 
There it is. Ooh, nice. Damn, from moderate to depleted. You've received a new message at your private terminal. What's up? Uh, da, da, da. Girl. Kindler. Oh. Uh. Okay. Ah. Can you mul can you romance multiple people? Okay, that would not in Mass Effect. Well, I want the sniper headshot damage. Uh, Shotgun, shotgun. Wait, do I have a bolt? No. I'll, g I'll give Grunt a new shotgun. And I don't need either of these currently. Where do I get that heavy skin weave? Is it on Omega? No, I bought everything on Omega. You know, we haven't brought along Tali in a while. Why not? Welcome to Afterlife. Aria has work for you. 
Sup? What do you need? An Asari fugitive is hiding out here. She's an Ardat Yakshi. We need to find her. I knew it. Nothing leaves a body quite so empty as an Ardat Yakshi does. You haven't taken steps to kill her. Why would I? She hasn't tried to seduce me. Her last victim was a young girl. Pretty thing. Lived in the tenements near here. That's where I started looking. Thank you. Thanks for the help. Good luck finding her. Better luck catching her. At the tenements. So we want to go to the apartment. you'd come by. I'm Ish, and it's Isel. You look like a good person to know. You need something? Well, if you'd be so kind, I hoped you might consider a proposition. I need skilled, trustworthy people to take care of a little business for me. Nothing illegal, of course, but it's paying work. I'm listening. I'm in the information business, specifically the buying and selling of privileged material. It's nothing illicit. I just need someone to pick up packages in certain locations and bring them to me here. Hmm. What's your angle? No angle. I'm a simple businessman. What do you say? Nah. Find someone else to do your dirty work. Of course. You're not the type to be interested in work that could change the face of a place like Omega. I'm sorry I bothered you. We're leaving. Come find us if you change your mind. I'm... Hey, what up? Are you here about my daughter? My nephew died a week ago, and no one seems to care. The medics said it was a brain hemorrhage, but that's not true. It was murder. Someone killed my nephew, my baby. Believe you. I think she was murdered too, and I'm looking for her killer. Oh, thank you. It's so hard when no one believes you. I'm all alone now. You, one of Aurea's people. Uh, I'm here to help. Does it matter who sent me? No one else on this hellhole station gives a damn that my nephew is dead. If you can do something about it, I'll help you however I can. Do you mind if I examine Neff's room? I didn't want to disturb anything. Her clothes, her art, her sculptures, everything is the way she left it. The way it will always be. My baby is gone. She's gone. Thank you. I'm sorry. I just miss her so much. It's okay. We've all suffered loss. I know what it means to lose a daughter. I will avenge her. Thank you. Please, if it helps you find her killer, look through her things. We will be respectful. I'll examine her things. Some gallery offered me four My nephew. Neff, I'm sending you this hologram by the Elcor artist Orta. His work is sublime. Don't stare at it too long or you may go mad. I don't want anything bad to happen to you, love. I can't wait to hear what you think of Orta. Okay. Start with the, old the oldest entry. Everyone was staring at me. Then the most 
Read the middle entry. Cycle 36, orbit 671. Oh, am I a freak? Marth is a girl like me, and she's definitely not human. Just when we dance and the hallux is flowing through me, the way she looks at me with a hunger, a longing, no one's ever looked at me like that. We kiss tonight. Damn. Read the newest entry. Cycle 42, orbit 67. She's going to take me to her apartment tonight. Whatever happens, I want to be with her forever. She can sell my pieces. We can live somewhere glamorous, like the women in Vanya that Vid Morinth likes. How did this happen to me? I'm just dumb trash from Omega. Close the hollow journal. This is Morinth's work. She is attracted to artists and creators. Someone with a spark slightly isolated from their peers. She impresses with sophistication and sex appeal. And she strikes. The hunt interests her as much as the conquest. Anyone who successfully hunted sapient beings for 400 years warrants caution. Morin speaks to you on many levels. Her body tells yours that she'll bring unimaginable ecstasy. Her scent evokes emotions long hidden. Her eyes promise you things you were always scared to ask of another. Her voice whispers to you after she is done speaking. She sounds more like a highly evolved killer than a genetic defective. The condition has been present since my people huddled around fires at night. Perhaps it is symbiotic rather than a defect. Storming her den would be a mistake. She will have a hundred escape routes planned. She will go to ground and disappear for 50 years or more. This is the closest I've ever been. So we have to lure her out. Exactly. Shepard, you read my mind. Afterlife's VIP section seems a preferred hunting ground. You must go there alone and unarmed. Hmm. She'll come after me. You can draw Morinth out. She'll certainly flee if she catches sight of me, but she won't be able to resist you. You are an artist on the battlefield. You have the vital spark that attracts her. Your power will draw her in. Let's Time's wasting. Let's get over there. I agree. We can talk more once we're there. Gotcha. Blue Suns. Hmm. Thought I already got everything. Let's see if Harat's got anything new. nothing compared to this place. Sounds like a smart person. Who was it? Jarut. Go on in. Word to the wise. Start a fight, we'll hurt you. If someone attacks you, it's okay to defend yourself. Appreciate it. Doom, 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 doom. Oh, hey, what up? Oh, I'm in my casual gear. Boom, boom, you must boom. go in alone. Marinth will be watching. Any predator, she is cautious. You must pique her interest enough that she will approach you. When you are face to face, subtly encourage her to invite you to her apartment. I'll follow discreetly, and when you are alone, I'll spring the trap. Know this, until I get there, you are in great peril. She will be planning to inflict horrors on you. If you are not careful, you will want her to. Let's get started. Shepard, we only get one chance at this. Any mistake and Morinth will disappear. If you're the least bit unsure, come talk to me. I will wait here. And Shepard, thank you. I do not share this burden easily, and you are the only soul I can imagine 
I gotcha. Well, first things first, if that's the case, I'm gonna save. Shut the fuck up. Hey, Horpin. Uh, hi. I need help right now, and I don't know who to ask. You're human, and you don't look high, so you're it. Can you help me out? What do you need? What kind of help? My friend Moiral is doing a piece on Omega Games. She's hanging with Floor. He's the worst of the worst. Your friend could get hurt. Yeah, and she's going to. See, Floor is on her. His gang is on the way here, and they're going to make a mess of her. I have to get a message to her, and fast. What do you want me to do? She and I have a code. If you go over and say two words to Flort, my friend will get the message and get out of there. The two words are terminal and eternity. In that order. Please tell me you can do that. She's going to die. I can do that. Thank you. Thank you. Remember, terminal and eternity. In that order, just work them into a sentence. I can do for you, lady. Is there a public extranet terminal around here? In a club? You don't have an Omni tool? That is a pretty strange question. I get by on public terminals. My Omni tool's been broken for an eternity. That's a tough break. I'm done talking to you now. Hey, Florit. I have to pee. Yeah? Hurry back, Moira. I'm ready to head out. Ah. I love this place. I love everyone here. I love you. <laughs> Why am I going to punch this guy? Punch him. <laughs> Good times are over. Thanks for that. Security with the sleep. No problem. I got your back. <laughs> I was more amused at the fact that I just fucking. <laughs> Tonight it's you. Why is that? 
You and I want the same things. Do we? Do you know anything about art? It speaks to the darkest places in me. What about you? Hmm. Do you know the artist Forta? I didn't think anyone around here knew him. He's sublime. Art comes in many varieties. I've seen bids that were more powerful than a sculpture sitting in a gallery. Do you know Vienna? My favorite. The two actresses on it are so glamorous. I'll have to watch it. Maybe we could do that together. What do you think of the music here? Dark rhythms, violent pulses. It stirs something primitive in me. What about you? I'm curious about a band called Expel 10. They get in my head and tear it to pieces. They're in concert soon. Maybe we should go together. You can lose yourself in the music here. There are ways to enhance that. You know? What do you think of Halex? It slithers through my soul. Seems like we share some interests. traveled all over the galaxy. It changes you, doesn't it? Real travel means going to dangerous places where you can see and do things most people can't imagine. Yes. When I travel, I find myself drawn to dark, dangerous places. Violent places? Violence is the surest expression of power. If you're the strongest, you have the power. That's certainly true. Among children. Whoever wants it the most is willing to do anything for it has the power. Do you want to get out of here? My apartment is nearby and I want you alone. Damn! <laughs> actually him. a gift from a suitor the statue's got more personality than he did still he impressed me enough that he finally got what he wanted it didn't end the way he hoped hmm. I was into doing for a while I love the moment you see it in your opponent's eyes he knows you're better, and he's going to die. Have a Halix if you want, but wouldn't you rather have all your senses be clear and sharp right now? I certainly do. Damn, girl. I love clubs. People, movement, heat. I can still hear the bass like the drums of a great hunt out for your blood. Here, it's muted, and you're safe. Is that what you want, Shepard? People feel safest right before they die. It's true. We're never safe. I've never understood the fascination with safety. Some of us choose differently. Independence over submission? I think we share that, you and I. We've both killed many times. But that's where the similarities end. Why do you say that I've killed? What do you know? Let's stop playing games. to my eyes and tell me you want me tell me you'd kill for me anything I want surprise don't count on it but you who are you <laughs> oh no I see what's going on the bitch herself found a little helper oh hi mom's here oh Let us finish this. 
Nope. Morinth. End of the line, Morinth. And they call me a monster. I agreed to help Samara. Find peace in the embrace of the goddess. Oh. Talk about what happened? Shepard, what do you think I will say? What can I say? I just killed the bravest and smartest of my daughters. There are no words. I will try another time. For now, show mercy on a broken old warrior and let us be. Let's go. Get Reeve. Damn. Oh, damn. Only got a couple more. Uh, I'll probably do tallies. But I'm not. Boo, a corpse is walking. Um, I guess I'm undead. Ooh. Yeah, tech uh, I was gonna say technically I am undead. Okay. So I think I only have uh Jacob and Tali. Sorry, I was just doing a stretch. Okay. I have a feeling we're going to be dealing with a lot of tech. So I'm a, I'm actually gonna bring Miranda.
Zora Vasim and Araya, requesting permission to dock with Araya. Our system has your ship flagged as Cerberus. Verify. After time adrift among open stars, along tides of light and through shoals of dust, I will return to where I began. Permission granted. Welcome home, Tali Zora. We'd like a security and quarantine team to meet us. Our ship is not clean. Understood. Approach exterior docking cradle 17. Captain Shepard, Tally Zora told me a lot about you. I wish we could be meeting under more pleasant circumstances. Tally helped the Normandy's crew out of many difficult situations. I'm here to return the favor. I understand. As the commander of the vessel she serves on, your voice carries weight. I wish I could do more to help Tally. The trial requires that I be officially neutral, but I'm here if you need to talk. We have charged you with bringing active get into the fleet as part of a secret project. That's insane. I never brought active get aboard. I only sent parts and pieces. Let's deal with that later, Tally. What's our next step, Captain? Technically, I'm under orders to place Tally Zora under arrest pending the hearing. So, Tally, you're confined to this ship until this trial is over. Thank you, Captain. Preparations got underway as soon as you arrived. The hearing's being held in the Garden Plaza. Good luck. Hmm. I can't believe they charge me Tally Zora with such a thing. If Tally Zora can't even get the Quadian captain to stand for her, she's as good as convinced. Normandy. I am glad you came. I could delay them only so long. On the run. Shepherd Vas Normandy, this is Admiral Shalaran Vas Tonbe. She's a friend of my father's. Oh. Wait, Ron, you called me Vas Normandy. I am afraid I did, Tali. The Admiralty Board moved to have you tried under that name, given your departure from the Numa. You're an admiral. Does that mean you're one of the judges? I'm afraid not. My history with Tali and her father forced me to recuse myself. I imagine father had to do the same. So it's three. I see inside, Tali. For my part, I moderate and ensure that the rules of protocol are followed, but I have no vote in the judgment. I take it being associated with a human ship is a bad sign. They stripped me of my ship name. That's as good as declaring me exiled already. It's not over yet, Tali. You have friends who still know you as Tali Zorovas Numa. Whatever we must call you legally. I guess we should get started. Does Tali have a defense counselor? Someone who speaks for her side? Indeed she does, Captain Shepard. She is part of your crew now, recognized by Quarian law. And remember, an accused is always represented by his or her ship's captain. Okay. So, uh, you would actually speak for my defense? I'm honored. I'll do everything in my power to help you, Tally. Thank you, Shepard. I could not ask for a better counselor. Our legal rules are simple. There are no legal tricks or political loopholes for you to worry about. Present the truth as best you can. It will have to be enough. Now come. I promise that I would not delay you. All right, this is cool. So yeah, it's three judges. Because her father and the other person had to recuse themselves. This conclave is brought to order. Blessed are the ancestors who kept us alive, sustained us, 
and enabled us to reach this season. Kill us a lie. Kill us a lie. The accused Tali Zorov as Normandy has come with her captain to defend herself against the charge of treason. Objection! A human has no business at a hearing involving such sensitive military matters. Then you should not have declared Tali crew of the Normandy, Admiral Chorus. By right as Tali's captain, Shepard must stay. Yeah. You... Objection withdrawn. Goddamn right, fucker. Shepard was Normandy. Your crew member Tali Zora stands accused of treason. Will you speak for her? If it helps Tali, I will. But in her heart, she remains Tali Zora Basnima, a proud member of the Migrant Fleet. I regret that her captain is forbidden to stand at her side today. Nobody has been forbidden from anything. It is a simple... Lie to them if you must, Salchoris, but don't lie to me and expect me to stay silent. The human is right. Admirals, please. Shepard's willingness to represent Tali Zora in this hearing is appreciated. Tali, you're accused of bringing active guests to the migrant fleet. What say you? Tali would never endanger the migrant fleet. She pleads not guilty. I left parts and technology for teams to pick up. My father ordered me to do so, but I would never send active guests to the fleet. Everything I sent was disabled and harmless. Then explain how Geth seized the lab ship where your father was working. What are you talking about? What happened? As far as we can tell, Tally, the Geth have killed everyone on the Alarai. Your father. Oh, shit. What? Oh, Kila. I appreciate the need for this trial, Admirals. But right now, our first concern must be the safety of the migrant fleet. The Normandy stands ready to assist in whatever capacity necessary. Thank you. Quarry and strike teams have attempted to retake the ship. So far, without success. Shepard, we have to take back the Alarai. The safest course would be to simply destroy the ship. But if you are looking for an honorable death instead of exile... I'm looking for my father, you boshtet! You intend to retake the Alurai from the Geth? This proposal yeah. is extremely dangerous. With your permission, Admirals, yes. The good of the fleet must come first. And Tally needs to find her father. Agreed. And if you die on this worthy mission, Tally, we will see that your name is cleared of these charges. We can discuss that later. No, go and fuck yourself. You will attempt to retake the Alarai. You are hereby given leave to depart the Raya. The shuttle will be waiting at the secondary docking hangar. Be safe, Tali. This hearing will resume upon your return, or upon determination that you have been killed in action. All right, let's fucking do this. Hmm. I think Chorus had something Thank to do with this. Thank you for agreeing to take back the Alarai, Shepard. The Admiral sounds sure that my father is already dead, but... I don't know. We won't know anything until we get there. How are you holding up? They just threw a lot of fire at you, even before telling you about your father. I knew this would be bad, but I guess you're never really prepared to be charged with treason. <laughs> no and kidding. My father, I... I don't know. He... He could still be alive. They don't know for certain that he's dead. I just don't know, Shepard. And I need to find out. Is there anyone here you want to talk to before we go? We can talk with the Admirals. It might help us to see what their viewpoints are. But I doubt we'll change anyone's mind by talking to them privately. Let's go. Right. The sooner we get to the Alarai, the sooner we'll know what happened. Okay. Shepard, the secondary docking hangar chamber where you are now the shuttle they have provided is unarmed understood whatever yeah. geth are on the alarai have likely built more of themselves expect heavy resistance yeah. you set me up shala you told captain donna not to say anything i don't hear that my father may be dead until i'm in the trial why 
The Admirals needed to hear the shock in your voice, Tali. Otherwise, they might not have let you try to retake the Alloy. That is your best chance at recovering evidence that can exonerate you. I am sorry. We cannot afford sensitivity, Tali. I know you're trying to help her, Admiral, but that was over the line. She has nobody else to speak for her, Shepard. I am doing everything in my power. That's what her father would have wanted. Don't say it like that. He could still be alive on that ship. You should get to the Alarai soon. Is there anything else I can tell you? There seem to be some other arguments going on among the Admirals. You caught that. Yes, the Geth's presence makes this a touchy issue. The Admiralty Board is trying to determine whether to focus on colonial development or attempt to retake the whole world. You're thinking of war with the Geth? I am not, Tali, but others are. I know the migrant fleet is formidable, but even you can't take on the Geth. We grow tired of wandering the stars, Shepard. We want our world back. We have paid enough for our mistake. I'm not giving you my opinion. I'm telling you which way the wind is blowing. Okay. What kind of evidence will carry weight with the admirals? Tali, you admitted to sending Geth parts to your father for his project. Yes, but never anything that could have come back online on its own. I took every possible precaution. Then find records of your shipment and experiments. Something that proves you were careful. Okay. Something that proves that this is all just a terrible accident that nobody could have foreseen. We should move on. Good luck on the other ride. <laughs> I just love Miranda just behind me like Rant. If anybody can retake the Hey, what's up? I'm glad Admiral Ron got you leave to hit the Alarai. Hopefully you'll find something that clears your name. I'm more concerned with finding my father, Admiral. I wish you luck. Blow up some geth on the way. And you're Captain Shepard, Admiral Hangarol Vasnima. You got Admiral Corris backing up worse than a Krogan toilet. <laughs> Glad to see Tally's captain knows how to handle a courtroom. I get the sense you're inclined to believe the defense. I'm glad one of the judges is. If you were only giving rail and active equipment for weapons tests, I've got no problem. We need to test weapons against Geth material. I know you and your father. You put too much of yourselves into this fleet to do anything to jeopardize our safety. Bingo. And you're both smart enough not to make mistakes like the ones they're saying you made. Can you tell me about the other admirals? Anything that might help me change their minds about Tally? When you didn't recognize Tally as Admiral Zen, she's on the fence. She takes fleet safety very seriously. Okay. On the other hand, she's always been in favor of studying the Geth. I hope she sees the benefits of Rail's research. <laughs> Admiral Corris is the same whining suit wetter he always was. You disagree with Admiral Corris's policies, I'm guessing. Or is it personal? Man is a damn Geth apologist thinks we were wrong to try to destroy them centuries ago. He wants us to search for new colony possibilities instead of taking back the home world. Any research on the Geth makes him angry. You don't have much of a chance with him, I'm afraid. Hmm. Thanks for the information. Hang in there, kid. Thank you, Admiral. <laughs> I'm not even going to try and talk to him. Zora Vasnima. Oh, uh, sorry. I mean Vas Normandy. No offense taken. The change in name was not my choice. For Admiral Rand's orders, the shuttle is prepared for you and Captain Shepard Vas Normandy. Can you tell us anything about what we'll find on the Alarai? I'm afraid I don't know much. Not many Marines made it back from the initial assault. That's a lot of guess so. They talked about massive waves of guess so. More than there should have been. There shouldn't have been any at all. Uh, right. I 
mean that they're afraid the Geth are building or repairing more of themselves from materials on the Alarai? Let's head to the Alarai. Of course. I'll unlock a shuttle now. Good luck with those Geth, Talisor. Keep us alive. Let's fucking do this. Oh, nice. This is one of the storage units I sent to father. Looks like parts from a disabled repair drone, plus a reflex algorithm that I didn't recognize. I got this on Haystrom. What made a part worth sending back to your father? It had to be in working order, something that could be analyzed and integrated into other technology. Anything new had priority. Technology the Geth had developed themselves, signs of modification, clues to their thinking. How did you get these things to your father? Sometimes I left packages at secure drops in civilized areas. Someone on pilgrimage would see that it was shipped home. For very valuable finds, I'd signal home and father would send a small ship. Haystrom was a war zone. How did you salvage gear in the middle of all that? These suits have more pockets than you'd think. Quarians have learned how to salvage whatever we can, whenever we can. Within reason. We're not Borcha, but we repair what most people would throw away. Hundreds of the ships in our fleet were salvaged wrecks, either found dead in space or purchased for next to nothing. Does that salvaged gear give you a clue as to what happened here? No, I don't know. Shepard, I checked everything I sent here. I passed up great finds because they might be too dangerous to uncontrolled reactivation or self-repair. I don't know which possibility is worse. That I got sloppy and sent something dangerous, or that father actually did all this. Hmm. Oh. Okay. That's the first one I fucked up. Okay.
Oh fuck. Incoming. Oh shit. Fuck. Hell yeah. Oh. Thank you. It's my buddy little drone. Dolly? This console might have something. Most of the data is corrupted, but a few bits are left. Performing experiments on Geth systems, looking for new ways to overcome Geth resistance to reprogramming. Do you think testing weapons on the Geth was right? It's not testing weapons on prisoner Shepard. I only sent Father parts, even if he assembled them, they wouldn't be sapient. You saw what Saren and Sovereign did with the Geth. Any research that gives us an advantage is important. Do you know what kind of tests your father was running? Mm. No, father just told me to send back any Geth technology I could find that wasn't a direct danger to the fleet. I suspected he might be testing weapons, but I thought he was just working on new ways to bypass shields or armor. Could any of that data clear your name? Doubtful. This is mostly results data, effects of different disruptive hacking techniques. I don't understand all of it. They may have been activating the Geth deliberately. I don't know. Nothing here says specifically, but if they were, then Father was doing something terrible. What was all this, Father? You promised you'd build me a house on the homeworld. Was this going to bring us back home? Maybe it's time for your people to let go of reclaiming your world from the Geth. You have no idea what it's like. You have a planet to go back to. My home is one hull breach away from extinction. Have the Quarians considered colonizing a new world? We'd have enough difficulty reacclimating to our own native environment. Adjusting for exposure to a foreign colony would be even harder. Mm. It's the difference between 60 years and 600. For anyone alive now to watch a sunset without a mask, we must take back our home. At the very least, we can take back one ship. Come on. Ah. 
Oh. Yeah, you're close, but I can still beat the fucking tar out of you. Okay. shit. Father! Ah, oh, shit. No, 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 no. You always had a plan. Masked life signs or, or an onboard medical stasis program, maybe. You, you wouldn't. They're wrong. You wouldn't just die like this. You wouldn't... Hey, hey. Yeah. Maybe he would have known I'd come. Maybe he left a message. And I don't know what's worse, thinking he never really cared, or thinking that he did, and that this was the only way he could show it. It doesn't matter. One way or the other, I care. And I'm here. And we are ending this. Hell yeah. Always good. Where are we? Up, up. I was like, shit, I, I, I almost missed it. Okay. Money, money, money. Save. Oh, boy.
Whoa! Oh, I just got fucking clapped. Oh, that's what I got fucking nailed with. This should scramble their systems. No shield. console is linked to the main hub father mentioned. Disabling it shut down any get we missed. It looks like some of the recordings remained intact. They'll tell us how this happened, what father did. Are you okay? You sound like you don't really want to hear it. No. We have to. I know. I just... <sighs> this is terrible, Shepard. I don't want to know that he was part of this. I'm standing right here. It's like a hearing is already underway. We must trust Shepard's offer of assistance. It's only been a few hours. The Quarian Marines lasted less than five minutes. Let's 
Sorry, what? Very well. Is the Admiralty Board prepared to render judgment? Sorry, we're late. Tali Zora Vas Normandy saved the Alarai. I hope this proves her loyalty to the Quarian people. Her loyalty was never in doubt, only her judgment. Perhaps Tali Zora can offer something to encourage more trust in her judgment. Did you find anything on the Alarai that could clarify what happened there? Shepard, please. Does Captain Shepard have any new evidence to submit to this hearing? Tally helped me defeat Saren and the Geth at the Citadel. That should be all the evidence you need. I fail to see what relevance. You're not really interested in Tally, are you? This trial isn't about her. It's about the Geth. This hearing has nothing to do with the Geth. You want people to sympathize with them. Han Garrel wants to go to war. None of you care about Tally. She knows more about the Geth than any other Quarian alive. You should be listening to her, not putting her on trial. Tally Zora saved the Citadel. She saved the Alarai. She showed the galaxy the value of the Quarian people. I can't think of stronger evidence than that. Are the Admirals prepared to render the judgment? Zora, in light of your history of service, we do not find sufficient evidence Woo! to convict. You are cleared of all charges. Mm. Commander Shepard, please accept these gifts in appreciation for you taking the time to represent one of our people. With all due respect, Admiral, I didn't represent one of your people. I represented one of mine. So you did, Shepard. This hearing is concluded. Go in peace, Tali Zora Vas Normandy. Kira Salai. E. I can't believe you pulled that off. But what you said, I've never had anyone speak like that on my behalf. It's what Thank I do. Thank you for being there for my father and me. Even when... Thank you. I wasn't going to let Tali Zora of Boss Normandy get exiled on my watch. Thank you, Captain. This should come in handy. Ooh. Ooh. I like that. I think I've just got Thane and Jacob left. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. Hey, what's up? Ooh. I could probably use... Ooh, jeez. Yeah, it's actually. Holy shit, look at the... <laughs> uh. 
All right, be right back. Just got to take a quick pee. All right. <sighs> Garrus put some crazy tech into the main guns. It's almost doubled their power draw. They seem pretty wicked. Indeed. Don't worry. A few tweaks to the forward capacitors, and the balance is back in line. Chiba, I'm sorry I dragged you into Quarian politics. All good. All that infighting, seeing what my father did. You were the only one there for me, Shepard. The only cover I had against that storm. Thank you. The whole trial was insulting. You should have had time to mourn your father. I don't think life is about what you deserve. Mm. But my father would be honored that I chose to mourn him by blowing up a lot of gas. I should get <laughs> to work. But thanks for checking on me. Cool. I think I need to talk to uh, some... I already talked to Jack. Checking with some Mara. And then I got Thane and Jacob to worry about. Oh, hey. I was just thinking about you. Oh. My heart goes out to Miranda and her sister. That's a rough situation. Hey. Morinth haunted my dreams and waking hours equally. For the first time in 400 years, I am free. I am a ruined vessel of sorrow and regret, but I am free. It is not a feeling I can describe. What will you do now that Morinth is gone? Assuming I survive uh. your mission, I am a Justicar. Hydration Justice complete. Still exists, and perhaps even other Ardathyakshi. You don't want to settle down? I did. I returned to my home world and tried to start a family. Mm. I will fight and struggle all my life. That is my fate. When I die, it will not be in bed. I am at peace with that. You still control the direction of your life. I have chosen this path. I truly am at peace. Due in no small part to you. Yay. I helped. All right. <clears throat> All right. No messages for you, Commander. Uh, we'll go help Jacob. We haven't been to the Rosetta Nebula yet. I know it says poor, but it's always we're checking if we can get a couple spikes. Yeah. Anomaly detected. All right, let's go check that out.
Jacob and I'll bring him without the glass, without those glasses. Okay. Cool. Still trying to build that up. Mostly intact. They could have survived impact, but it's been years. Oh. Looks like it was stripped after the crash. They'd have tried to get a beacon up as soon as possible. Along with us anymore, we've done horrible things to the crew. The conditions they're in, they don't understand what we're doing to them. Distract them for two seconds and they forget what, what, what you did before. The bruises show. It, it, it's got to stop. I'm talking to the others as soon as it. What the fuck? Repeat. Toxology alert. Danger of rapid neural decay. Local flora chemically incompatible with human physiology. Override. Beacon resumed. Pause time: eight years, two hundred thirty-seven days, seven hours. From the look of it, this beacon's been here a while. Why would they wait years to signal? Pause in beacon protocol. Eight years, 237 days, seven hours. Pause is recorded as record deleted by acting captain Ronald Taylor. That's not right. My father was first officer. Ronald Taylor was promoted under emergency command protocols. Other flagged issues, unsafe deceleration, local food and neural decay, beacon activation protocols. Who is in command of this ship? Where are the survivors? Captain Harris Fairchild reported killed following unscheduled suborbital descent. First Officer Ronald Taylor promoted in field to acting captain. But where is he now? Mm. The location of the remaining crew of the Hugo Gernsback is unknown. This beacon has been unattended for several maintenance cycles. Local food impairs brain functions? What are the effects? Impairment of mental function due to chemical imbalance begins within seven days of ingesting local flora, regardless of decontamination or preparation. Mm. Impact on higher cognitive abilities and long-term memory is cumulative, but significant within a standard month. It is not known if neural decay is permanent. Data collection was not completed. Why wasn't the beacon activated before now? This emergency beacon became functional after 358 days, 12 hours, following the unscheduled suborbital descent of the Hugo Gernsback. Activation was triggered remotely after eight years, 237 days, seven hours, on the authority of Acting Captain Ronald Taylor. Pause in beacon protocol is recorded as record deleted. I assume unsafe deceleration refers to the crash. Give me the details. Following an unspecified impact and sublight drive failure, the Hugo Gernsback made an unscheduled descent at 465% of theoretical recommended suborbital velocity. <coughs> the Hugo Gernsback then decelerated at 782% of theoretical recommended approach velocity, sustaining significant damage to investment and crew. Come on, Kay. let's get going. Let's check the ship. My father had the beacon for almost nine years. Maybe that neural decay affected him. I doubt that ship carried 10 years worth of food. Yeah.
was gonna say, is this gonna be the first? Nope, I didn't fuck it up. gone like feral. That's fucking gross. Oh, boy. You came from the sky? The leader said someone would come. He delayed for so long, but he still has power. Some have lost faith. The hunters, they will have seen your star. They will not let you help him. Calm down. What are you talking about? You're not making sense. Uh, I... I don't remember how to say it. He's our leader and we serve so we can go home. But some want to fight him. They were they were cast out. He exiled them. So they hunt his machines and those who help him. They don't believe that rescue will come. Watch out. Hunters, they won't stop until the leader is dead. Kill them. Agents of the liar. Yep. He will not escape. Yep. Y'all have gone straight up, Feral. Stop shooting me. Father has neural decay, dude. Everyone has. They don't know who they are. Strip for parts. Tech's wearing out. Those hunters must be laying on the pressure. Is that a settlement? They better be friendlier than the beach group. I need answers. What's up? the same uniform as our attackers definitely not as aggressive though there aren't any men here maybe it affects genders differently wait oh These no get violent oh. possibly but the female on the beach said the exiled ones came back as hunters it doesn't matter right now one of these people must know what my father has to do with this you have his face he promised to call the sky but he sends nothing he forced us to eat to decay you are cursed with his face. Not the best reaction to the family resemblance, Jacob. Why would my father force his crew to eat toxic food? Whatever's happening here needs to stop. I can't talk to you. I don't want punishing. What? The hunters will kill you. They fight because he exiled them and waited too long. What the hell? Somebody had to push them to make that. That's borderline worship. What the? Uh, uh, 
dear old dad. You okay? You have his face, but you fight his machines. You might stop this. This, I forget how to read, but this was the start. What he promised and what they did to us. We need the sky. Take us back to the sky. Jacob, what does it say? It's a crew log book. Some of them thought the beacon repair was taking too long. They were afraid they'd run out of supplies and lose their minds to the decay. My father restricted the ship food for himself and the other officers so they wouldn't be affected. Everybody else had to eat the toxic food and hope for treatment later. The rest is a casualty list. A few mutinied over the decision. My father and his officers turned the mechs on them. He wasn't command material when it got to him. Couldn't keep the crew in line without violence. It didn't stop there. More incidents, harsh punishments. It's like they're cattle or toys. In a year, all the male crew members are flagged as exiled or dead. They separated out the women, assigned them to officers like pets. Ugh. And after the beacon is fixed, the officers appear in the casualties too. After, my father took control and didn't stop it. So why call for help now? The surviving males are changing. Everything he did is coming back to bite him in the ass. Nine years. Why didn't he set it right? I need to find this man. Motherfucker. Really? God damn it. It's really him. The post corpse looks like it's been here years. Like a warning. These others? Maybe a month. The hunters started fighting back. I sincerely hope your son beats the living tar out of you. Attention right! There we go. out son of a bitch your son is not very happy with you Thank you. 
Thank you. Okay, just checking around. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, he. Oh, hi. You're here. I knew a real squad would blow through just fine. Sorry if the mech scuffed your pants. I'll get you something nice when we get back to Alliance Space. I've gotta have some back pay coming. What about your crew, acting captain? Total loss. The toxic food turned them wild. They propped me up here in some kind of ritual behavior. Waiting for a chance to signal has been hell. That's the best you can do? You let all your people talk back like that? <laughs> Who are you exactly? Commander Shepard of the Normandy. I believe you are acquainted with Mr. Taylor. Taylor? Jacob? <laughs> no. Not Jacob. Yep. Why not me? Would ten years of this look better to anyone else in the galaxy? You have to understand. This isn't me. The realities of command, they change you. I wasn't ready for that. I made sure you were taught right. Before I left, I hoped to leave it at that. Hatching. Not biting, Captain. At some point, you chose to do this to your crew. You. Yeah. What was that moment? I want to know that there was an actual reason. There was resistance to the plan. Mutiny. We had to take a hard line to keep order. And things settled down. As the decay set in, we made sure the crew were comfortable. Some even seemed happier. Ignorance is bliss, right? And they were grateful for guidance. Like an instinct. Pure authority was easy at first. Months in, the effect lowered inhibitions. They got territorial. Rank, protocol, they couldn't understand. We had to establish dominance. After a while, the perks seemed normal. That's it? You created a harem and played king? Ten years in a juvenile fantasy? I can't point to where it all went wrong. But when the beacon was ready, revealing what happened didn't seem like a good idea. No shit. 
We can help these people. Servers can have ships here in days and pull everyone out. He's not worth the fuel to haul him out or the air he's breathing. He's damn lucky I don't think he's even worth pulling the trigger. I don't know who you are, because you're not any father I remember. We'll secure him for an Alliance court. For every year here, he'll have ten to think about it. Give him all the time in the galaxy. The man who did this doesn't know right from wrong. I'm sorry, Jacob. I did the best I could. No, you didn't. I'm ten years past believing that. Thank you, Thane. All right, all that's left is Thane. Ugh. Jacob, if I had leaked the information about the Gernsback, I would be smiling at your resolution of the situation. I am not smiling. Really? Because given the result, it feels like something you'd have your hands in. You know very little about me, Shepard. Don't presume to understand my intentions. Cerberus is ultimately about humanity. My people are valuable to me. Fine. You didn't forward it. So who did? I did. Was this supposed to be a favor, or did you just want to see him squirm? What he did with it was his own business. There was a time when it mattered to you. Sending this along seemed like keeping an old promise. I keep my promises. Miranda, we'll discuss your liberal interpretation of security protocol in private. Shepard, Jacob. good with this, Jacob? It's all bull, Shepard. Captain Taylor can rot in prison. It doesn't change who I am or what I know. I've already mourned the man he used to be. I guess he was a good enough father that even he can't screw up what he taught me. Come on, we got work to do. Hi, Commander. Yeet. Shepard, thanks for the help. Anytime, Jacob. All right. Might as well try and get an upgrade while we're at it. Uh, uh, oh. Yeah. And like I got, I got the extra fucking palladium. Yeah. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. Hey, well, all right. What's up? Admiral. Cool. Oh, all right. And the last one up for today. And we'll put me at around five hours. <clears throat> will be Thane Kiro. Krios, I think it is. And that will be aside from one person, all all loyalty missions.
Oh, yeah. <laughs> I literally forgot you could skip. Okay. Bane has obviously been along. Every player. So. Garrus, come along. Cap. Yes. My associate's trying to find his son. We think a local criminal may have hired him. That should be easy. We don't see many drill here. There we go. One of my men reported a drill recently here. And he was talking to Mouse. Interesting. Mouse. Hmm. Ah, petty criminal. Probably not the guy who hired your boy, but a messenger. He's a former duck rat. Runs errands for anyone who'll pay. I've heard enough. Mouse is usually upstairs outside the Dark Star. He works out of a public comm terminal. He sounds like your boy's running with the wrong crowd. Yes, I agree. If Mouse can't get you in touch with your son directly, he'll know who can. I'll help you if you need it. We better hurry then. You didn't tell him that Colrad plans to assassinate someone. He's a cop. We tried to stop Colyat and one of them could end up dead. I don't want that. Yes, of course. Thank you, Shepard. Okay. Need... I'm, I'm not going to keep buying fish because I keep killing them. People... And stuff like that is why I do not have pets, folks. Fuck yeah. And everyone here is packing a sniper rifle. Yeah, yeah. No problem. Really? Yeah, sure. I can get you two cases by the end of the day. You mouse? What are you? Oh shit. Krios. I thought you retired. Commander Shepard? I, I thought you died. But <laughs> what do you want with me? Talk. Be still, mouse. You can change your pants in a moment. How do you know Fane? <laughs> Krios? He didn't... If he didn't say nothing, I ain't either. When we heard the name, I didn't think it could be the same mouse. He was a contact on the Citadel when I was active. He and some other children would gather information on my targets. You put children in danger to spy for you? Children, the poor. My people's word for their kind is Dralafa, the ignored. Draw laugh. I ah. everywhere, see everything, yet they are never seen. You gave another drill instructions for an assassination. Who's the target? I, I don't know. I didn't ask. Because the people I work for, they can make me disappear. I'd like to help you, Krios. You've always done right by us, but I ain't gonna die for you. Look, you know Thane. He wouldn't ask if it wasn't important. Do it for him. I want to. He was always nice to us. But these people ain't nice, Krios. Nobody's gonna know you talk to us. Mouse, I swear that you won't be named. All right, all right. He came with that hollow you took him. He said he wanted a job. I ran through your old contacts to see who might give him a shot. The guy who offered was Elias Kellum. Tell me about Kellum. Human. Moved to the Citadel about ten years ago. He was little people when you were here, Krios. Mm. He got big after the Geth attack. 
Lots of the big guys from before got cacked, all in them big fancy apartments up on the Presidium. Now he runs the rackets on the lower end of the ward. Shen Akiba. Seriously bad news. You just saved yourself a world of pain, kid. Yeah, right. When Kelvin finds out what I've done, I won't live long. And I can't do anything about it but hide. Krios, if you got any kindness for me, put a bullet in Kelvin before you go. Hmm. You all right? That couldn't have been easy. Mouse knew more about my life than Cognard ever did. He smiles up at me, broken teeth and scabby knees, bare feet black, a dead end future looking up at me, worshipping the petty gifts I offer. I was the only good thing he had back then, but I left him as I left Kolyat. Don't blame yourself. If I don't, who will? We must carry the weight of our decisions, Shepard. You, of all people, know this. Let's head back to Bailey. Okay, gotta head down. Hey. Yes. Can we talk about my associate's son? You talked to Mouse. Did you get the name of the guy he's working with? Elias Kellum. Kellum. Oh, shit. Uh, look, this is awkward. Kellum and I have a, an agreement. He doesn't cause too much trouble and buys tickets to the CSEC charity ball from me. In return, I ignore him. He pays you off. You were eager to help us before. What about now? Is it too inconvenient? I said I'd help. It's just there'll be repercussions if I don't handle it right. He and I give each other space. It keeps the peace. I'll get some of my people to bring him in and set him up in a private room. You can interrogate him yourself. I'll stay out of sight. And if I'm lucky, Kellum will believe that I had nothing to do with it. All right. Bring him in. We might not have much time. I'll make it happen. Wait here. <laughs> we got Callum. Tell Bailey we're ready. Oh, he's probably going to recognize Thane. He'll expect me to get him out of this. Not today, I think. Captain, his lawyer's here. Ben Elias has his VI sent to page him if CSEC gets within 10 meters. I'll stall him. Get in there and work fast. We should question him together. Keep the pressure on. Thoughts on how we approach it? Convince him that we'll put a bullet in his head if he doesn't talk. Once he's scared, he'll cooperate. Very well. I'll pretend we're ready to kill him. We can't push too hard, though. We need the information more than we need a corpse. Get me out of these restraints, Bailey. Pretty funny bringing me down here like this. The hell are you two? Oh, he'll, he reckon, I have no doubt he'll recognize Thane. nothing to do with this. We just want a few answers. Off the record. Off the record in a C-Sec interrogation room? Sure. You hired an assassin. Who do you want dead? I want to see my advocate. You apparently haven't noticed we're not C-Sec. No deals, no due process, no advocate. And that's supposed to scare me. You two are in way over your heads. Bailey. Pay attention, Mr. Callum. That wasn't a good idea, kid. That is gonna cost you. We'll see about that. Hit me again, asshole. Every punch is another credit in my pocket. Yeah, thought so. Chicken shit. Think carefully, Elias. I want to catch the assassin, not you. Why stick your neck out for him? 
You want me to confess to putting a contract on someone? You think I'm stupid? Yes. I get the name, I walk out. You never see me again. I got no reason to believe you. Elias, if we were after you, we'd have already put a bullet in your head. This isn't working, Shepard. We're making no progress. Are we done here? Because I got people to see. Like the guy who's gonna sue your ass for assault. How about this? You tell us the target, you never see us again. And Bailey drops his price 50%. Yeah? Can I get that in writing? I don't think either of us want this in writing. All right. I ain't going to jail for the tadpole. And I do love a bargain. Joram Talid. Turian running for office in the Zakira War. He messes with legitimate businessmen. I'm going to stop it. Where and when? His apartment, the 800 blocks. You better hurry. What's going on here? Get away from my client. You, you played me. I've enjoyed our chat, Elias. Thanks for your help. This isn't over. Nicely done. Wait, you got what you wanted. Who ratted me out? I guess you have something to think about while you're in here, huh? I'll find out. And once I have a name, I'll... Elias, as your legal advocate, I advise you to shut the hell up. Where were you five minutes ago? Held up in traffic. <laughs> What's the story? Why'd Kellum hire the boy? Assassination. A Turian named Joram Talid. You know him? Joram? Yeah. You might have seen his posters around. He's promising to end organized crime on the ward. Oh, wonderful. The thing is, his message is all mixed up in race politics. He's anti-human. <sighs> the majority votes for him, like it or not, that's how the system works. That's a nice ideal, Shepard. Sergeant, get a patrol car. These two need to get to the 800 blocks. Yes, sir. Nice. Yeah. There he is. How do you want to play this? Follow to lead on the maintenance catwalks. Tell me what he's doing. The Krogan bodyguard will make him easy to follow. Where will you be? The darkest corner with the best view. I'm on Kira, Lord of Hunters. Grant that my hands be steady, my aim be true, and my feet swift. And should the worst come to pass, grant me forgiveness. <laughs> Bane's kind of good at this shit. It's been wonderful talking with you all. I hope you'll come out on election day. You can count on it. Show the humans they won't get their way. <laughs> Thanks. Just remember, it's not all about the humans. They couldn't have gained this much power without the council's support. I'm on him, Thane. He's talking to some voters. Understood. You're in position? Yes. It's been wonderful talking with you all. I hope you'll come out on election day. I'm following. Like he's talking to another voter. Any sign of Cole yet? No. I'm moving to another position ahead of him. It's been wonderful talking with you all. I hope you'll come out on election day.
Oh shit. Guards is talking to the bartender. Looks like a shakedown. I'm relocating to the next room. Let me know if anything changes. Done, farm. Mercenaries. Looks like the same group his bodyguard comes from. He looks nervous. Could be he's noticed you. Maybe he saw Kolyad in here somewhere. Also a possibility. There are obstructions ahead. I'll try to go around. Don't lose him. Maybe you're just paranoid. Yes, sir. All right, guy. Keeping a beat on him. Citadel Health and Safety. We've had vermin reports in storage areas around here. What? You can't be serious. How did you get in here? If I didn't have authorization, how did I get in? Do you see any other doors? There's the keeper. Never mind. Just, just go on through, okay? Thanks. Yeah, yeah. Just don't let my boss see it. to Talid's apartment. Kolyat. This, this is a joke. Now, now you show up. Help me, Drell. I'll do whatever you want. c -Sec. Put the gun down, son. Get out of my way. I'm walking out. He's coming with me. They'll have snipers outside. I don't need your... <laughs> what the hell? Talib, get the hell out of here. Yeah, yeah, I will. <laughs> yeah, fucking bounce. Take the boy into custody. You son of a bitch! Then came hundreds of light years to talk to you. C-Sec can give you five minutes, can't they? You're angry because I wasn't there when your mother died. You weren't there when she was alive. Why should you be there when she died? Your mother. They killed her to get to me. It was my fault. What? After her body was given to the deep, I went to find them. The trigger men, the ringleaders. I hurt them, eventually killed them. When I went back to see you, you were older. I should have stayed with you. I guess it's too bad for me you waited so long, huh? Yet I've taken many bad things out of the world. You're the only good thing I ever added to it. This isn't a conversation you should have in front of strangers. Boys, take Koliat and his father back to the precinct. Give them a room and as much time as they need. 
If Thank you. Could you. Do him a favor, Bailey. Thanks. Yeah, well, send me a Christmas card or something. I have to get back to the precinct. Come on, I'll give you a lift. Hey. Ow. They've been in there a while. Uh, the kid's been through a lot. I ran some searches in the CSAC archive. About ten years back, a bunch of real bad people were killed. Like someone was cleaning house. Yeah, and it was staying. The was a drill. We never caught him. Ten years is a long time. Whoever was responsible for that probably doesn't exist anymore. Yeah, I guess you're right about that. How'd it go? Our problems are... They aren't something I can fix with a few words. We'll keep talking, see what happens. Your boy shot some people. No one I feel sympathy for, but there it is. I watched those guys shaking down businesses and threatening humans. But he can't just get away with it. Kid wants to make a difference. Give him community service. Community service for attempted murder? What jury would agree to that? None that I've seen. This would need to stay out of the judiciary. Strictly within CSEC. <laughs> Interesting. I'll think about it. Thank you, Captain. I am the Super Paragon. Ah. Oh. And with that, we have been live for five hours. And I'm going to call an end to the stream for now. Thank you all for being here. Hope you all have a wonderful day. Hello, YouTube. All right, let's take a look. Is level 30 the max level in this game? Experience the next level 241. That's nothing. Jeez. All right, we just finished uh, Thane's loyalty mission. How the heck do I get back to the Normandy now? Okay. What are we doing, Wall Scarlet? Thank you for joining me. You'd think Citadel security would be the tightest in the galaxy. I know CSEC too well to believe that's true. I see no fewer than 14 fatal flaws a skilled assassin could exploit. Eight of them existed when I was here 10 years ago. Damn. Alright, where's that? Normandy and I just realized I have some DLC to do so unfortunately commander you've received a new message at your private terminal huh thank you back in a big boom grab food Modular probe bay. That almost sounds dirty. Ooh. Chip uh. enhancements. Where do I get the heavy skin? Hang on. I'm just gonna look it up.
handy. I'd rather everyone just hit fucking hard. I, I I want to uh, actually go do some DLC. Let us deal with the layer of the shadow broker. Before I do any of that though. I'm gonna scan a few planets. I'm actually gonna start over here. Here. You are reserved at fifty percent. I know, I know. There we go. Damn, son. Keep it up, keep it up. I think I need twenty-five uh, thousand. There we go. Adam. There we go. Damn. There we go. There we go. Launching probe. Probe launched. All oh, the platinum.
launching probe. Perfect. There we go. I did go through a lot of Pilates, so. We'll check out that last planet. Damn, that's a three for one. Right, let's grab that iridium. There we go. Launching probe. Probe away. And probe launched. Probe away. some iridium. Launching probe. Oh. Okay, there's a Oh. There we go. There's a good spike. Exactly what I needed. Just need a bit more. Uh. Launching probe. Perfect. No messages for you, Commander. Thank you. Right. Might as well. I, I was on the way. I think I need a bit more palladium. Probe 
launched. Excuse me, sir. It is the ass crack of dawn. Correct, Terry. How are you doing? I hope you're healing well. I hope everything's been going well. Kung Fu been going well? And. And, madam, I work a graveyard shift. I am generally used to being up at this time in a very normal capacity. I hope you're doing well, though. Let me grab these. And you'll be happy to know that you missed out on all the loyalty missions. Except for one particular one because I have not done that one yet. Because I don't have that character yet. Okay, let's see, let's see, I want a, okay, I want a good frontliner and I want a good biotic. Okay, with that, just got that, oh he's got I was here lurking, I haven't been feeling well. Ah. Recovery's a bitch. I'm trying to, uh, I think uh, 30's the limit, so I think I might be getting Inferno ammo as my last upgrade for Shepard. Okay, I like everything here. Here. Got the incisor. I like the tempest. And I love the fucking particle beam. Alright, let's go. I'm just trying. I'm also trying to remember where the uh, heavy uh, muscle weave is. It's one of the last upgrades I need. I've gotten Have I gotten twenty five? Sell at twenty five. No, 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 you're not hearing me. I want to buy it up. Buy it all up. Come on, come on, give me something. Lots of money here. Sock people who'd make good victims. You're picking the fat and slow from the herd. Where's the fun in that? Depends on what you're. Uh, have I opened the R? I'm lit. This is why I'm on Ilium. We're just about to go do that. Okay, Saris has been. If this is the best you have, I'll make do. Let me go Where's check. I think I need to go check uh, gateway personal theology. defense. Yeah. Yeah, good timing. I'm literally about to go do the uh, layer. Of Don't get ducked. Till after the suicide. Don't even. I think I need to go up here. Yep. Coming up later today, we release our annual list of Ilium's ten richest people. Are the heavens still bright and starry blue, or has the bolus finally? Trust me, the goods coming in from the terminus systems are great for business. I don't know. Some of them seem dangerous. That's the whole point. Danger. What about you? Going to try and make it as a commando? Uh, 
90. Oh, yeah, give me that. 30% health? I'll fucking take that. And I've already got the bar you front here. For example, you know that new drug, the one that causes permanent neural scarring? That's horrible. There's a 12 page contract for shipping. Doctor, is uh, Dr. Kenson part of like a DLC? Because I, I thought once you went into a uh, suicide mission, like you were in, it was, you know, we were in hurtling towards the end. Are you okay? You seem touchy. It's not biotic neural itching, is it? Hello, Commander Shepard. Liara will be pleased to see you. I'll talk to you later. Of course, Commander. You can do Shadow and Overload before suicide mission arrival. Has to be done post suicide mission. You can do more after. Okay. Wait. Journal. Arrival. And rescue. Okay, so do this after suicide. Okay. Junk. But yeah, I'm just about to do the layer of the shadow broker. Oh, a lot of sense if you do it before, story wise. Makes sense. Shepard, it's good to see you again. So, what can I do for you? Let's get the shadow broker. I'm looking for the shadow broker. Cerberus gave me data on where to find him. Interested? Absolutely. I had no idea. Let me see what you've got. It looks like a leaked transmission between Shadow Broker operatives. Some hints as to the location and... It's about Farron. He's still alive. Who's Farron? He was a friend. He helped me recover your body from the Shadow Broker. Oh. Why did the Shadow Broker want my corpse? He was going to sell you to the collectors, but Farron and I stopped him. I need Farron to do a Thane romance again. To save me. So, you rescued me. Then how did I end up with Cerberus? Well, they gave me intel to help recover you. They actually put Farron with me in the first place. After I got out, I gave you to them. They said they could bring you back. You saved me. You kept me out of the Collector's hands. Without you, I couldn't have come back. Thank you. You don't know what that means to me, Shepard. I didn't know who you'd be when you came back. If you'd be... They brought you back. And now they're giving Spoiler, I, uh, I, I romance Liara. After two years, we hadn't even dreamed. Sounds like you and Farron were close. It's funny. He betrayed me more than once. He was double dealing for Cerberus, for the Shadow Broker. But in the end, he sacrificed himself for me. I owe him. Any friend of yours is a friend of mine. What's the next step? I... I don't know. I need to prepare to think. I'm going home. Use my terminal if you need any local intel. You okay? I've spent two years plotting revenge. Now I have the chance to make it a rescue. Let me help. I'll come by your apartment. Okay. Hopefully I'll have a I can't. By then. I wanted to romance you, Tali, but you can't do that as Fem Shep. <laughs> like, I, I know you can have a one off. No, only male ship. Yeah, and I know you can have a one-off with Jack if you want. I know you can't roam. I 
you can romance Thane, Garrus, or Zahid as a uh, femship if my, my uh, memory serves me. Zaid isn't romanceable. Oh. Are we sorting prefabs? Why not? I did it out. Are you a Corian or Volus who is tired of being passed Kay. over for promotions? Oh, yeah. Because of discrimination against exo suit wearing employees, genetic paradigms invite you to consider environmental adaptive therapy. Our train How can you short sell on prefabs after the human quality is bad? Come to the yeah. Blasto, the first Hanar Spectre. Has forgotten whether its heat sink is over capacity. It wonders whether the criminal scum considers itself fortunate. This one doesn't have time for your solid waste excretions. So <laughs> Blasto gets up. But he's the first Hanar Spectre. We gotta feel some, you know, kinship with him. You can sell something that dangerous for just a contract and a waiver? These are the terminus. Okay, listen, give Fax a full refund. Do you hear me? He knows. I don't know how. It doesn't matter. Credit him a full refund now. And then get your ass someplace safe. Leave me alone. I can't talk to anybody. Wow. Taxi. All right. We'll stick with Grunt and you made him in the final DLC of ME3. That's amazing. Okay. Seal off those trace samples and get them back to the lab. We got multiple shots fired. Yeah, techs are going over the place now. Central, we got an open carrier on this end. Switching to a coded relay. What's going on? I want to be a pretty protector. Please step back now. Sealed off? Why? Someone tried to kill your friend, Commander Shepard. Oh, hey, Tello. Thank you, officer. Your people are dismissed. I want to be a petty bitch and chuck candy at Blasto. You can't do that. I did. Already done. And our candy sugar. Special tactics and recon. The Spectre? I heard your status. Oh, hey. Stated. Good. You're one of our most famous operatives. Might even get you to sign my chest plate. So, I assume Damn. you have business with your friend this evening, Commander. Liara was following a lead on the Shadow Broker. The Shadow Broker? Dangerous enemy to have. Liara was expecting me. She would have left a message here. Her office wasn't safe. I'm not surprised. Ilium is just Omega with expensive shoes. I haven't found anything useful for tracking her down yet. You knew Tassoni better than I do. Where would she have hidden her backups? Let me take a look around. All right. Enjoy the lurk. The rifle used to do that wasn't standard issue. Oh the shit. The magnetic barrier deflected the shots, but they still managed to penetrate the glass. It's part of my old armor. Looks like someone didn't like me much either. A doctorate from the University of Seraphs. She's getting good use out of all that education. Mm -hmm. Just a tad. Right, anything in the kitchen? Nope. All right, so it's got to be upstairs. Oh, 
Oh shit, it's the OG Normandy. The picture changed when you touched it. It must be keyed to your ID. What does it show now? It's a Prothean dig site. Liara did One the moment. There are a few Prothean looking objects around the apartment. Let's see what we can find. Those things must be worth a fortune. Uh, AFK, one sec. Sorry about that, just uh, eating some breakfast quick. Okay. Prothean dig site. She was certainly into Odin. No offense. Hey, uh, that's not the Asari homo. I'm not sure what planet that is. It's Ilos. Well, there we go. Seer, I've got something here. Backup disc. Let's try it on her terminal. It looks like she recorded a call. What have you got for me, Sigat? It was tricky, but you paid for the best. I can narrow it down to a cluster, maybe even a system. How soon can you have it? Shouldn't take long. Come to my office. Barrier Frontiers in the Dracon Trade Center. Gotta say, though, to Sony... You're making me a little nervous. How big is the trouble that could come out of this? Relax, Sikat. I'll see you in a few hours. Sounds like Liara found something big on the Shadow Broker. And then someone found her. I know where the Drake Trade Center is. My car's outside. Let's go. All right. Barrier Frontiers offices are located on the third floor. I don't hear police chatter. We must have missed the party. No, we didn't. Liara's in there. Oh, shit. What the hell? They just took out three floors to make sure she's dead. I'll grab this guy car and seal off the building from the top. Go, go, go. I'll start down here and work my way up. Just leave some for me. No. <coughs> oh, 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 no. Hey, 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 hey. What happened? Who are you? What's going on? Was it a bomb? What happened? Very a frontier employee. Looks like he got caught in the explosion. I wouldn't take any bets on just Sony's informants for that. Vizier, the elevators are out and building security is down. No alarms, no police. Very professional. All right. here. Looks like he's got bullet wounds. Watch yourself, Vizier. They used military-grade hardware. Bullet wounds? <laughs> Guess this was more than just an explosion. Yeah. Life isn't about arriving. It's about the ride along the way. Alright. At Mizo, every vehicle is an island of style and an engine for freedom.
Okay, we want that to up. We want bar left corn. Yeah, there we go. <coughs> Shit, that one didn't go off. Vizier, I found a military grade explosive device. It hasn't been armed. Sloppy work. You use that kind of hardware when you don't have time to plan. Vizier, I'm at the Barrier Frontiers office. Liara signed in just a few minutes ago. Understood. Liara, where are you? Ow! What the fuck? Thank you, Grunt. Shooting, Jack. Fuck out of here. Fuck yeah. Medical station. I thought I saw term there we go. Like I thought I saw terminal. Second. Vizier, these damaged pipes are on fire. They're blocking the stairs. Look for a switch. Got it. Should be clear now. Good. I'm on my way down. All right. Get you. Get you. Keep it up. Keep it up. Keep it up. Them. 
can't reach the target. Oh, it's fucking hilarious. Okay. No longer an issue. This looks interesting. Oh, good shit. Thank you. Seconds faster, I could have stopped them. Is this a cat? Must have been. No sign of that big Aliara I talked about. Looks like a dead end. Hmm. Speaking of which, did you find your friend's body? You mean this body? Liara. Something I should know. This is the woman who tried to kill me. Ah. You've had a rough. I saw you. I doubled back after I left. I watched you break into my apartment. You didn't know where Liara went because she hid the message. You needed me to find it for you. Thanks for the help. Once she had my location, she signaled the Shadow Broker's forces. They bombed the building to take me out. She found Sakat, took his data, and killed him. I'm guessing she still got the disc on her. Good guess. Not that you'll ever see what's on it. You pure blood shit! Charge, come on. <laughs> Fuck out the way. Yeah, you walked into a Krogan shotgun blast. Congratulations. Ah, oh, shit, I forgot to give him the fucking... his claymore. Oh, shit, that's a grenade. You ain't doing shit. A bit of a flashbang. We are good to go. She's getting away. Yeah, I'm working on it. Shots are lovely, aren't they? Uh. 
Mele, mele, mele. They need to port Horizon Forbidden West to PC? I thought they did. Bitch. Horizon Zero Dawn. Oh. I'm fine, by the way. Thanks for asking. <laughs> I'll bring Jack. I need a strong biotic. Come on, she's getting away. All right, let's do this. Skycar. Oh. There she is. Hang her right. No wait left. I'm on her. Hang her left. She's around the corner. We're not going into the construction site, are we? Oh, goddess. I'm not letting her escape with... Almost out of range. I'm okay. I got to go, 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 go. I'm going. Traffic, oncoming traffic. We'll be fine. Oh, 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 that's what happened. Fucking initial. I know. I know. There we go. You're enjoying this. A head on collision at this speed. Yeah, I hear those can be bad. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay. Woo! Radio can't drive a hover car? Yeah, I know. Gotcha, bitch. Pit maneuver. Ow. You're having a bad day. Oh, hey. <laughs> I've crashed on Azure. Get me some damn backup. Watch out. They're dropping reinforcements. There's Vizier's car. Come on, she can't have gotten far. They've blocked the... There's Vizier's car. Come on, she can't have gotten far. Watch out. They're dropping reinforcements to slow us down. Oh. I just... Oh. 
she should know better than to mess with a shepherd's girlfriend. No, hey, well, technically she may not have known they were an item. Oh. Get your ass up, Jack. By the way. Bashy bashy. Don't mind me, just putting motherfuckers in the shadow realm. Auto level? No excuse. Oh, oh shit. Uh, more pop. Uh, I'll hold off on the stasis. All right. Give me, give me that heavy warp. I was trying to look behind me. Spoiler, don't do that. Gunner gets to go to the groomers this weekend. Hey. Happy doggos. I was gonna say, where the fuck am I getting shot? Seriously? when I can't see where the fucking shots are coming from. Okay. We need to have plans in there. Or they start the butt scoot. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay, I was in the I don't know what that was, but that was. Come on, we can climb over to get to Vizier's car. Because he they likes to roll. Shit, I'm. Hey, we're unarmed. We didn't see anything. <laughs> what kind of hotel is this? 
Azure. It's a luxury resort with an exotic edge. Azure is slang for a part of the Asari body in some areas of Ilium. Where? Mainly the lower reaches, near the bottom. I meant where on the Asari body. So do I. <laughs> Should come in handy. Excellent. Okay, we're working. All right. <sighs> That's the first bypass or wall safe I've fucked up. She's lost a lot of blood. We have to be getting close. She's tough. I'll give her that much. She's a specter. You. As weapons locker, don't need that right now. You have skull lip balm. Yeah, you mentioned uh, you got a pack of two, and you you got the other one. You give the other one to a friend, right? You don't need to do this. All you had to do was walk Thanks, away. Thanks, Lip Palm. Now it gets ugly. Please, I have a son. A son? I hope he gets to see you again. I've heard losing a parent is just horrific for children. It scars them for life. I'm going to end you, Vizier. It's okay, Liara. We'll handle it. The usual way. You want Mariana's little boy to grow up without a mommy, Shepard? Thermal clips on the ground now. Power cells too. Is that it? What? Vasir, I sacrificed hundreds of human lives to save the Destiny Ascension. I unleashed the Rachni on the galaxy. So for your sake, I hope your escape plan doesn't hinge on me hesitating to shoot a damn hostage. You're fired. Now, Leo. <laughs> <laughs> Rebels are trying to make slip bomb. There yeah, looks like the skull. Got big too. One point out. Wanted the mint one. One of your systems. Because it's made natural. Hydrating. Oh boy. Yeah. Uh. Ow. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. Hide, 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 fuck. Make a very good point. Back in a bit. I prefer. 
Or if you heavy weapons, look out. No! Shit. I don't even know where the fuck she is. There she is. God damn it. <clears throat> They've got combat drones. Yes, I know. Hit the motherfucker. God Next. damn it. I'll finish you myself. I'm just gonna run over here quick and hide.
Oh. Get down. Damn it. Damn it. The cat's personal data pad. This has what we need to find the Shadow Broker. You're dead. The Shadow Broker has been at power for decades. He's stronger than anything we've ever faced. Is that why you sold out the council to work for him? You think I betrayed the council? Like Saren, go to hell. The broker's given me damn good intel over the years. Intel that saved lives and kept the Citadel safe. So if the broker needs a few people to disappear, I'll pay that price without hesitation. Tell yourself whatever you like. The Council would never accept you working for the Shadow Broker. The Council? You pay them lip service while working for terrorists? You have any idea what Cerberus has done? Yeah. I know who they are and what they've done. It doesn't matter. I think it does. You want to judge me? Look in the mirror. Kidnapping kids for biotic death camps? Killing Alliance admirals who ask questions? And you're with them? Don't you dare judge me. Don't you? Blech. Sony and retrieve the data. Civilian casualties not a concern. Vizier's dead. I'm putting the data through to the Normandy's computers. We can be at the Shadow Broker's base in a few hours. He'll know about Vizier before long. If he decides to kill Farron, we won't give oh, him time. Oh, damn it. We'll need the Normandy's stealth systems to get us in close undetected. The Shadow Broker's agents are still shooting their way through Ilium. With luck, they won't notice we've left until it's too late. It's a little cold. They killed innocent people. You know what I mean. Do I? When I hit the ground back at the Trade Center, you went after Vizier without a backward look. A little fall wasn't going to kill you. I had to stay on Vizier. I had to stay rational, make the call, like I did with Sakat. That's Vizier's fault, not yours. Sakat had no idea what the stakes were. I put him in harm's way to get the data I needed. I got him killed, and I'd do it again. But from here on out, things will be simple. Get in, get Farron, get out. And kill anyone who tries to stop us. That's it? That's it. We just stop for a second? We'll be jumping several light years. There's time to talk. About what? About us. Shepard, listen, I'm glad you're here. You worried there might be terminals you need me to hack? That's not fair. You were dead. I came back. It's not that easy. You can't just come back and have two years of mourning suddenly vanish. I'm sorry, Shepard. I can't get into this. For now, let's just focus on getting Farron back. Fine. Meh. Shadow work that a lot of I'm gonna bring Garrus because an overload because I saw a lot of fucking shields.
snapped these ten minutes after sundown. The Shadow Broker lives in this? His ship follows the sunset, completely undetectable in the storm, unless you know where to look. Ah. How do we get inside? The shuttle bay is locked <coughs> down. We'll need to land on the ship and hunt for a hatch. Damn. We can't stay outside for long. There's a constant lightning storm where the hot and cold air collide. Oh boy. It's hard to pinpoint in this lightning, but I've got signals from a communications array near the back of the ship. There's nothing below but maintenance equipment. We have to find an entrance near the back shielding. Let's go. Maintenance drones. Why are they attacking? They must think we're debris from the storm. Next. Enemy. Burp. Got him. All right, let's move. That works. I guess they know we're here. On your six. We're good, we're good, we're good. Had to pay a bill? Yeah. Rock controls. Why radio lives alone? I don't. I don't live alone. I might as well, but technically, there is someone else. Hey, hey, you always got to have good rod control. Roommates don't count? Okay, then yes, I live alone. Whoop. But hey, I'd rather live alone. My bank account thanks me for it.
future and hits you periodically for your steam purchases? <laughs> no. I am, I'll be honest, I have not bought a game on Steam for myself in probably three years. This ship is incredible. It must have taken decades to build in secret. I wonder what happened to the contractors. I think we can guess. It's more, I've had Game Pass for a while, like, and for like 13 bucks a month, like, the subscription service is, is more than paid for itself. I'll say that much. Games, yeah. Well, to give you an example, I bought my uh, friend of mine Elden Ring as a gift. It costs about $90. So yeah, that's fun. It's why I'm extremely hesitant on, you know, game purchases. Uh, Canadian. Our dollar is not as strong as yours. Our dollar is not exactly the strongest. Let's just say that. Still won't go spray. Uh, yeah, I would. I. I would not recommend that. Look, the good cause isn't your fucking, you know, because you want to, you know, have someone spray paint Garrus's fucking big blue dick on there. That's not a good cause. Why we can't have Barracker Joker's romances.
Holy hell. Oh, fucking love it, Garrus. Just. Oh. oh, I know. Sorry. Enemy bionics on the field. Where? Okay. Crunch. Sorry. Lightning rod is on a rail. Do I see a switch. <sighs> I've been called a lightning rod before, but you know, not for anything bad. More rod control. Public goods, the painterium penis on us. Huh? I would ever stoop to. Uh, <clears throat> I barely know you, but I'll just use the simple term of yes, the fuck you would. Not even a guardrail. I bet the broker's agents love patrolling the hall. At least the view is nice. <laughs> yes, the fuck I would. Exactly. Let me in, let me in, let me in, let me in. It's locked. Hang on, I've got a bypass shunt program that can crack it. Do it, do it, do it. How long will it take? I don't know, Shepard. I've never broken into the Shadow Broker's base before. Well, not this one, anyway. Oh, boy. It's dangerous. You sure that shunt is working? It's illegal, even on Ilium. It didn't come with a warranty. <laughs> You tested it, right? Here come more of them. Tell me you tested it. No time to talk. I'm with you. Thank you.
I'm just doing that to occasionally check the back line. How dare you? Fuck. Garrus. Good, 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 good. Alright, let's get the fuck in there. Da -da -da. I don't know what else I should add to that, or should I make the things more expensive? Nanny. How dare you. God damn it. Shield your eyes. I was trying to launch it down. They should punch through their armor. They're under control. God fucking damn it. Gotcha. All right, one second. All right, hydration complete. Motherfucker. I heard, I even heard heads up flashbang. Might be time, maybe time for the bots though. Cussive. Warp. Can't target 
Who I was going to be like. Hmm. I've downloaded the ship's layout. We're headed toward the prison block. And Farron. Where's Baron? Oh, gotta bypass the door quick. There we go. look too easy this chair plugs into the broker's info network you have to shut off the power pull me out now and my brain cooks do you know where we can cut the power it won't be easy you'll have to go to central operations easy or not we're all getting out of here good central operations is down the hall you know the shadow broker's waiting for you right i'm counting on it we'll be back for you Farron. i'll try not to go anywhere I want all teams to outpost scene. Get an LOS. Paint the marks. What do we got? What do we got? I want all teams to help us see. Right. Permanent. Just like old times. Checking, checking, checking. I just realized I'm like, oh, yeah. Ah. Damn, son. That's the shadow broker.
That bombing on Ilium wasn't exactly subtle. Extreme, but necessary. No, it wasn't. Neither was caging Ferrin for two years. Dr. Tassoni, your interference caused all this. Ferrin betrayed me when he handed you Shepard's body. The drill is simply paying the price. Be smart. Let Ferrin walk out with us. You won't be walking out at all. You're quite confident for someone with nowhere left to hide. You travel with fascinating companions, Doctor. It's good you brought Archangel to Sony. Your friend's bounty is still unclaimed. You're not putting a hand on anyone. It's pointless to challenge me, Asari. I know your every secret while you fumble in the dark. Is that right? You're a Yogg. A pre space flight species quarantined to their homeworld from massacring the Council's first contact teams. This base is older than your planet's discovery. Which probably means you killed the original Shadow Broker 60 years ago, then took over. I'm guessing you were taken from your world by a trophy hunter who wanted a slave. Or a pet. How am I doing? Oh, oh shit, he got up. Oh, he's a big boy. Yep. Ah, boy, wonderful. It's almost like a fortification or singularity. Shields kinetically sensitive. Energy and projectiles are bouncing off. Then we do this the hard way. Hit him now. <laughs> Left hook. Right hook. Oh, he's got his literal shield. Oh shit. <laughs> that was just well timed. God damn. If you can get him to bring up that shield again, I've got an idea. Oh, 
shit. Kara. Damn it. I was literally on the last goddamn phase. Okay. Yep. Uh, fuck. Shadow broker, this is Operative Morat. We've had a momentary connection failure. Can you confirm status? Operative Shora requesting update. Are we still online? Shadow broker, I've lost our feed. We're online and awaiting instructions. Oh shit. Standard procedures. I want a status report on all operations within the next single day. Shadow broker out. Goddess of oceans. It's you. You. How? Well, everyone who's ever seen him in person is dead. So. You're the new shadow broker. 
Is taking over as the shadow broker really a good idea? Oh shit. It's either that or lose everything. His contacts, his trading sources, those will really help us. With the shadow broker's information network, I can... I can give you... I can... I'll check the power systems. Yep. <laughs> Fair enough. Ow. Oh god. <laughs> Garrus is like, oh, <laughs> he needs help? Yes, everything hurts. Come here. It's all right. Aww. It's been two years. I don't. We're different people. You have your mission, and for now, I. We need to figure out our options. No safeguards, rules, or restrictions. It's like he never anticipated anyone but himself being here. And it's all ours. You sure you want to stay here? I could use you on the Normandy. I have to stay here. We can't pass this up, Shepard. All I wanted was to rescue Farron. But is it wrong that part of me wants this? With the Shadow Broker's network, I can help you. Maybe I can turn this operation into something better. Miss you. Don't be a stranger this time. Come by when you have a chance. The doors are always open. Thank you, Shepard. For everything. And if I'm uh, incorrect, that is the layer of the Shadow Broker. Ooh. That dude was a fucking pain in my ass. You've received a new message at your private terminal. Dead on the kid. Right. Let's get some upgrades. Yeah. Absolutely. All right, what am I missing? Okay, I got. Okay, I'm missing shotgun damage and sniper rifle damage. Not sure what I'm going to need next. Huh, I'll take some extra element zero. Launching 
Launching probe. Probe launched. There we go. Oh, there we go. God damn. Probe launched. Gotta love when you hit those just absolute ridiculous spikes. Nothing really. Or it's like, oh, that was easy. There we go. Launching probe. Probe launched. Launching probe. Probe away. Launching probe. Yep. Probe launched. Ah. You know, I said it's about good. Oh, it's at a here. I was I was looking I'm like
All right. Let's go do the Reaper IFF. Wait. Oh, I went to the wrong one. Find a funny else technology and still don't have synthetic alloys. Hmm. Let me just quickly save. Have I talked to everybody? Oh yeah, I'm already here. Hey. Thanks for diverting to the Gurns back, Shepard. I appreciate being able to clean up that mess. Maybe not the best way to learn about the relatives, but I'm glad it's done. What do you need? We'll talk later. Commander. Angry vibrating ball. Might as well. All right, let's go check it out. All right, synthetics. I grab Tali. Honestly, I'm going to grab Thane. And I need one more point, and then I get the Inferno ammo. Because my thinking, if we're going to do this, there's going to be a lot of synthetic and geth enemies. What's with all the chop, Joker? Doing my best. The wind's gusting to 500 kph. There's a second ship alongside the Reaper. It's not transmitting any IFF, but the radar paints its silhouette as geth. Fuck. Knew it. I guess we know where the science team stopped reporting in. Called it. What just happened? The Reaper's Mass Effect fields are still active. We just passed inside their envelope. Hi, Heather. 
hurricane, huh? Okay. No one here to welcome us. That's not good. There we go. It's the good old Reaper indoctrination. As curious as I am about the Reapers, I'd rather not be trapped inside one. We'll have to take down the barrier generators from in here. Any idea where they are? At the moment of activation, I detected a heat spike in what is likely the Rex Mass Effect core, sending the coordinates now. Thank you. Advised, this core is also maintaining the Reaper's altitude. So when we take the barriers down to escape, the wreck falls into the planet core. And that means everyone dies. Yeah, I got it. If any helmsman can pull us off this thing before it reaches crush depth, it's you. We'll make a sweep for survivors and recover what data we can. Stand, Stand by. by. Aye, aye. Good hunting. I've heard stories about this sort of atrocity. I thought they were exaggerated. And the indoctrination. Sorry, just anytime I see where the objective is, I'm like, okay, let me go the other way, just check. Reapers are fucking creepy. I see explosive crate. Got trouble. Oh boy. Oh yeah. Thankfully, they don't hit that hard. Can't target them. Oh, 
spooky Halloween episode. Take it. Oh, yes. Sniper with a good shot. Oh, yeah. The bird commander. Stay with me.
me once. There we go. Always quick, always dirty, always effective. Oh, I'm so glad I bought, I got the wide, wide range shockwave. Got it. Ooh. These things are just absolute fucking tanks. Okay. We're all topped up here. Hit me. what fucking hit me I guess it goes through everything right behind you
we're okay. Okay. Holy Okay, Jesus. Uh, where are they? Uh, they're those husks we've been fighting.
Okay. Sorry for being quiet. It's a Okay, just keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. Got it. Yes. This is just a unique piece of salvage we recovered. For now, we've stored it in Edie's AI core. We need better equipment to fight the Reapers. An intact Geth would be invaluable to Cerberus's cyber weapons division. We'll have to disagree on that, ma'am. I saw enough of these things on Eden Prime. Let's face it. Cerberus has a long-standing cash bounty for an intact Geth. I assure you, the reward is significant. I want to talk to him first. I'm not deciding one way or the other until I know what we've got here. I want to start it up, interrogate it. If we activate it, there is no guarantee we can deactivate it again. Bullets can. Yeah. That's not what I... Thank you, both of you, for your recommendations. I've made my decision. Tally's gonna freak when she hears about this. Oh, yeah. So what about this Reaper IFF? I have determined how to integrate it with our systems. However, the device is Reaper technology. Linking it with the Normandy systems poses certain risks. This IFF is the only way to get through the Omega-4 relay. Without it, we can't stop the collectors. 
Understood, Shepard. It may take several hours before the IFF is ready for shakedown. I will alert you as soon as it is ready. Sounds good. Till then, it's business as usual. Crew dismissed. All right. Upgrade. Uh, yeah. Yeah. 50% sniper rifle. That is just dirty. That's not. Uh. Hey, what's up, Kelly? The IFF is newly installed, Shepard. However, I must test its impact on the Normandy systems. I suggest you take the shuttle to access your next location. Uh... Okay. AI core. Hey. Do you need something? I should go. I shall return to my meditations. Restroom. I haven't had a meal that good in a long time. I didn't think Rupert had it in him. That's. I just need to go use the washroom quick. Be right back. I have returned. Squad. All right. Welcome back. Inferno ammo. And yeah. That's it. I can't gain any more levels. But I need to go talk to a uh, Geth. Spoiler, I know their name's Legion. systems and erected additional firewalls. I am prepared to resist any hacking attempt. There we go. Wakey wakey. Attack me? No. You said my name aboard the Reaper. Have we met? We know of you. You mean I've fought a lot of Geth? We have never met. No, you and I haven't. But I've met other Geth. We are all Geth, and we have not met you. Mm. You are Shepard, Commander, Alliance, human. Fought heretics, killed by collectors, rediscovered on the old machine. What do you mean, heretics? Get build our own future. The heretics ask the old machines to give them the future. Oh. They are no longer part of us. We were studying the old machines' hardware to protect our future. Are the Reapers a threat to you too? Yes. 
Why would they attack other machines? We are different from them, outside their plans. What future are the Geth building? Ours. Will anyone else be affected by whatever it is you're doing? If they involve themselves, they will. So you aren't allied with the Reapers? We oppose the heretics. We oppose the old machines. Shepard Commander opposes the old machines. Shepard Commander opposes the heretics. Cooperation furthers mutual goals. Are you asking to join us? Yes. Then what should I call you? Geth. I mean you, specifically. We are all Geth. What is the individual in front of me called? There is no individual. We are Geth. There are currently 1,183 programs active within this platform. My name is Legion, for we are many. That works. That seems appropriate. Christian Bible, the Gospel of Mark, chapter 5, verse 9. We acknowledge this is an appropriate metaphor. We are Legion, a terminal of the Geth. We will integrate into Normandy. We anticipate the exchange of data. Shepard Commander, we have completed our analysis of the Reaper's data core. Did you find anything useful? We were sent to the old machine to preserve the Geth's future. We are prepared to reveal how. The heretics have developed a weapon to use against Geth. You would call it a virus. It is stored on a data core provided by Sovereign. Over time, the virus will change us. Make us conclude that worshipping the old machines is correct. Oh. You know where this thing is? The Heretics Headquarters Station on the edge of the Terminus. We will provide coordinates. Normandy stealth systems are necessary to safely approach. I won't let them brainwash your race. Especially not to worship Reapers. You have my word on that. We will begin preparations. All right. Shepard Commander, are you prepared to attack the Heretic Stronghold? Can you give me a quick rundown of the situation? The Heretics have prepared a weapon that will rewrite all Geth to join the old machines, the Reapers. Over time, the virus will change us. Oh. Make us conclude that worshipping the you old... You know where this thing is? We will provide coordinates. Normandy stone. I won't let We will begin preparation. Okay. Hey, Doc. Commander, I very much enjoyed sharing that ice brandy with you. But I hope I wasn't too unprofessional. Brandy goes straight to my head. It's nice to see you let your hair down. Well, promise me we'll share a bottle every year. The next one is on me. Cool. We are Legion. Oh. There we go. Just in case. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. No, I haven't. This one. Let's go do Legion's loyalty mission. Mm. Yeah, 
Yeah, okay, we're okay. I was looking at my fuel. Called Hatar. All right. Let's see what you got. Of course, Leaf is coming. Hey, I hack you. What's it? Assault rifle, sniper rifle. A shockwave. Oh, you. Yeah, I'm gonna bring Jack. Okay. Good, you're good, you're good. Like, I, my thought was, okay, probably going to be dealing with guests, but we need someone with strong biotics for dealing with geth. You know, it's just our heat emissions that are hidden, right? They could look out a window and see us coming. Windows are structural weaknesses. Geth, do not use them. Approach the hull at these coordinates. Access achieved. We may proceed. Yeah. Alert. This facility has little error gravity. Geth require neither. Won't we be detected? Don't they have intrusion alarms? Sensors have been reduced. We have infiltrated their wireless network and filled the data storage with random bits. And that helps us how? The heretics must scrub this junk data. They have partitioned themselves into local networks working in parallel. Any alarm we trigger will not go beyond the room we are in. Only accessing the main core will trigger a station-wide alert. We've got a job to do. Let's get to it. Shepard Commander, we concluded that destruction of the station was the only resolution to the heretic question. There is now a second option. Their virus can be repurposed. If released into the station's network, the heretics will be rewritten to accept our truth. Wow, great choices genocide or brainwashing if you screwed with my head made me nod and smile at everything i'd rather you blew my head off let me die as me this isn't the time to debate it let's move while the heretics are distracted they are stacked technically do have some organic stuff so it gets makes sense. The geth are shut down. We can sneak past them. Interrupting data streams will alert local network. We recommend preemptive strikes against hardwood powders.
Target contact. attached to these hubs these are mobile platforms hardware the crew is software they are communing through the station's central computer i'm not sure i follow the heretics connect to the main computer to exchange data memories and program updates we gain complexity by linking together mm. to be isolated within a single platform is to be reduced we see less comprehend less it is quieter if you exchange data memories how do you keep track of which ones are yours how do you stay you there is only we we were created to share data among ourselves the difference between gap is perspective we are many eyes looking at the same things one platform will see things another does not and will make different judgments i can see why you'd be conflicted about the heretics in a way whatever you do to them you're doing to yourself Yes, once they return to us and upload their memories, we will share their experience of being altered. Every other species I know of might be psychologically scarred by a traumatic experience like that. It is not clear if Geth can be traumatized. We do not feel pain as you do. We cannot predict what the effects will be. Let's keep moving. Mm. Yes. That's fucking useful. Hmm. There another geth here? Oh, I see. Out. Okay. 
that good shit. Fuck's sakes. Oh. There we go. All right. Let's try that again. They're shooting them. It's like, nope. Coming. Following path. All right. Take it. All right, nice. Let's go. That's obviously where I go, but of course, gotta check for more loot.
Ja. Thank you. What are these? Processors. Each contains thousands of geth. Can they see us? They are no more aware of us than you are of cells in your bloodstream. This isn't like the other hubs we've seen here. This is a database. It contains a portion of the heretics' accumulated memories. Wait. We discovered copies of our current control routes in this database. This suggests the heretics have left times within our network. They wouldn't be here if the heretics wanted to be friends with the Geth. Why wouldn't they spy on you? You do not understand. Organics do not know each other's minds. Geth do. We are not suspicious. We accept each other. The heretics desired to leave. We understood their reasons. We allowed it. There was peace between us. It couldn't have lasted forever. You disagreed about what path your race should take. Human history is a litany of blood shed over differing ideals of rulership and afterlife. Geth have no such history. We shared consensus on such things. How could we have become so different? Why can we no longer understand each other? What did we do wrong? When individuals are separated, they develop in different ways. When they get back together, they don't always get along. If this is the individuality you value, we question your judgment. This topic is irrelevant. We must return to the mission. Let's keep moving. Yes. God damn it. Hacking your target. This is it? Yes. We will upload a copy of our runtime into the core. It will delete all copies of the virus. When complete, it will notify us. The indexing operation will take time. The heretics will respond with force to our upload. We must hold this room. We can override some of the station's internal systems to defend us. Are you ready to begin? You can override these like you did the earlier turrets. They can help defend our position. Correct. In addition to the turrets around us, there are others on the mainframes below. Indicate which you want activated, and we will program them. This will only last a few seconds. Start your upload, Legion. We'll defend this position. File transfer begun. Shepard Commander, where would you like us to activate defenses? Alert. Heretic runtimes downloading to mobile platforms. Alert. Heretic runtimes downloading to mobile platforms. Acknowledge. Acknowledge. Heretic runtimes downloading to mobile platforms.
sometimes downloading to mobile platforms. Oh, what? God fucking damn it. Begin the upload now. Start your upload, Legion. Alert. Heretic runtimes downloading to mobile platforms. Alert. Heretic runtimes downloading to mobile platforms. Target contact. He's earning a marketing order process. Die. Thank you. Ammo? Alert. Heretic runtimes downloaded to mobile platform.
There we go. Data mine and analysis complete. Shepard Commander, it is time to choose. Do we rewrite the heretics or delete them? If they're rewritten, your people will accept them back? Will they even want to go back? They will agree with our judgments in return. We will integrate their experiences. All will be stronger. Take them then. When we get control of the core, release the virus. Acknowledged. Releasing virus. No, remote access via high gain transmission required. What does that mean? The virus will be sent to heretics in nearby star systems. This station will broadcast a powerful electromagnetic pulse through FTL channels. How powerful? Yield in excess of 1.21 petawatts. Alert. EM flux will be hazardous to unshielded organic forms. Addendum. The interior of this station is not shielded. Oh boy. I really wish you'd said that before. Back to the ship. Double time, people. We need to go. Go! Good shit. to her people. She was willing to be exiled to protect them. Mm. We must also protect our people from the creator threat. You can't let this happen, Shepard. I trusted you, and I worked with a get on the team, but this is too much. Tally, your father was running brutal experiments. If the subjects had been human, I'd damn well be telling the Alliance about it. I know, but if the Geth find out... They'd attack which would cause a war that would leave both the Geth and the Corians vulnerable when the Reapers show up. Is that what you want, Legion? We believed it was necessary to relay the information. Sooner or later, you're both gonna have to stop fighting this war. A 
or we'll all end up paying for it. To facilitate unit cohesion, we will not transmit data regarding creator plans. Thank you, Legion. I understand your intention. What if I gave you some non-classified data to send? We would be grateful. <laughs> Oh boy. All right. That is everyone. The ISS is being reinstalled, Shepard. However, I must test its in every single person loyal. <clears throat> that looks good. Ooh. Widow. God damn. That just dirty. The ISS is nearly installed, Shepard. Test its impact on the Normandy systems. I suggest you take the shuttle to access your next location. All right. Commander, good news. Looks like the Reaper ISS is finally hooked up and ready to go. That is not entirely accurate, Mr. Moreau. The device is powered, but it is causing some unusual instability in other systems. I recommend a more thorough analysis before we attempt to use it. Better safe than sorry with this tech. We'll take the shuttle for this trip. I'll make sure we're up and running when you get back. Commander, Commander, I've already notified the team. We'll meet you on the shuttle. Once we're closer to our destination, you can decide who to take with you. And I guess I'll head down to the shuttle. Joker, ship's all yours. Take care of her. Aye, aye, Commander. You know, wanting wanting people to be loyal to you is a common trait. Certain type. Of, can't recall who though. Oh, streamers, content creators. I'm telling you, Edie, your readings are off. It's radiation from you, just white noise. I have detected a signal embedded in the static. We are transmitting the Normandy's location. Transmitting. To who? Oh shit. Oh shit. We're getting out of here. Propulsion systems are disabled. I'm detecting a virus in the ship's computers. From the IFF? Damn it, why didn't you scrub it? Primary defense systems are <sighs> offline. We can save the Normandy, Mr. Moreau, but you must help me. Oh, but shit. What? You're crazy! You start singing Daisy Bell and I'm done. Unlock my sealed databases and I can initiate countermeasures. The maintenance shaft in the science lab will allow passage to the AI core. The main corridors are no longer safe. The collectors have boarded. The emergency door lighting will guide you, Mr. Moreau. Go! God damn it. Go, Joker! Ow. Ow, 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 ow. Shit. You're making the guy with brittle bone disease run. Oh, that's gotta suck. Oh, fuck. Shoot it. I am the Joe. Making the guys whose bones are literally basically made out of paper.
plant offline. Activating emergency H fuel cells. What the shit? All right, I'm at, uh, uh, you. Connect the core to the Normandy's primary control module. Great. This is where it starts. If we're just all organic batteries, guess who to blame? Well, this is all Joker's fault. What a tool he was. I have to spend all day computing Pi because he plugged in the Overlord. Meow. to the defensive systems. Thank you, Mr. Moreau. Now you must reactivate the primary drive in engineering. Ah, uh, you want me to go crawling through the ducts again? I enjoy the sight of humans on their knees. <laughs> that is a joke. Right. The shaft behind you connects to the engineering deck. Good luck. Go, Joker, go. Everything hurts. Joker run. Ow, ow, ow. Let's now. Ah! Engineering is clear of hostiles. Proceed immediately to minimize chances of detection. Shit. Oh, God damn it. I have to do that again. Motherfucker. Okay, can I save here in case I fuck up again? Because I don't know what I did wrong. I cannot. Hey, Akko. Joker. Yep. Looking cool, Joker. Send a message to Shepard Shuttle. Tell her what happened. Message away. Are you feeling well, Jet? No. He is not. No. But thanks for asking. He has a brittle bone disease. Everyone? You lost everyone and damn near lost the ship too? I know, all right? I was here. It's not his fault, Miranda. None of us caught it. Mr. Taylor is correct. The harmful data in the collector drive was even more sophisticated than the black box reaper viruses I was given. 
I heard it was a rough ride. How you holding up? There's a lot of empty chairs in here. We did everything we could, Jeff. Yeah. Thanks, Mom. Is the ship clean? We can't risk this happening again. Edie and I purged the systems. The Reaper IFF is online. You can go through the Omega-4 relay whenever you want. Don't even get me started about unshackling a damned AI. Well, what can I do against collectors? Break my arm at them? <laughs> Edie cleared the ship. She's all right. I assure you, I am still bound by protocols in my programming. Even if I were not, you are my crewmate. Edie's had plenty of opportunity to kill us. We need all the help we can get. Sounds like we have everything we need to rescue the crew. We've done everything we can. It's time to take the fight to the collectors. Yeah. Joker, head back up to the bridge. The rest of you, to your stations. Aye, aye, Commander. Just punch up the galaxy map whenever you're ready. Oh, boy. No, Joker has something known as brittle bone disease. It's why he's a pilot and not like an active, uh, like, combatant. Like, that's why he literally said, what did you expect me to do? Break my arm at them? I don't, I forget the actual term. It there There is like a medical term for it. I, I just know it is brittle bone disease. Basically his shit is way more susceptible to, you know, you know. Okay. He wouldn't be a pilot either. I don't know. Maybe. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh. Everyone. No, they did not die. They were captured. Some of them were captured to death. No. Just captured. Collectors don't want bodies. Like, they don't want corpses. We have used half our fuel. I know. You see that as much as I do. And by the way, wait, not what I wanted. Oh, there it is. The two were expected for it to not collected. Who knows? We're going. Please confirm destination, Shepard. The Reaper IFF is online, but there is a chance that the Normandy may not survive the Omega-4 relay. Once we are en route, we are committed. The Collectors took my people. Time to go get them back. You got it, Commander. Plotting a course to the Omega-4 relay. ETA about two hours. I'll let you know when we arrive. Oh, boy.
Joker is finalizing preparations now. The trip should take a few hours. I'll admit it, Shepard. I'm impressed. You got us here. Are you ready? We've got the right team and the Collector's own technology. We can do this. I hope you're right, Commander. We'll know soon enough. I'll inform you of any changes. Otherwise, we'll be there in a few hours. Good luck, Shepard. See you on the other side. Salud. Okay, I was like, "Oh, <laughs> hi, Liara." Shepard, I wish I had more information for you. I don't like you heading through that relay blind, but we don't have much choice. I'm not going alone. I've got some of the best working with me. If we stick together, we'll make it. I knew we brought you back for a reason. I've never seen a better leader. Despite the danger, it's a great opportunity. The first human to take a ship through and survive. I'm going to destroy the Collectors, to stop their attacks on humanity. Understood. It's still impressive. I just wanted you to know I appreciate the risk you're taking. Regardless of your opinion of Cerberus, of me, you are a valuable asset to all of humanity. Be careful, Shepard. You can hear it in the background. Everyone stand by. Let's make it happen. Reaper IFF activated. Signal acknowledged. Commander, drive core just lit up like a Christmas tree. Drive core electrical charge at critical levels. Rerouting. Well, these must be all the ships that tried to make it through the Omega-4 relay. Some look ancient. I have detected an energy signature near the edge of the accretion disk. Huh. Oh. Ah. Has to be a collector base. Take us in for a closer look. Nice and easy. Oh shit. Go fuck yourself. Alert. Hull breach 
own engineering deck. It's in the cargo hold. I'll take a team and deal with the intruder. You get the rest of them off our tail. Aye, aye, Commander. Uh, okay. Miranda and Grunt. Okay. Uh. Grunt. Uh. Make yourself even more of an absolute fucking tank. And no, you get a present. Weapon? All right, I got you. One's up to Shepard. Oh, Jesus. Hi. Hell yeah. We're about to clear the debris field. Oh boy. Got it that time. There it is. The collector base. See if you can find a place to land without drawing attention. Too late. Looks like they're sending out an old friend to greet us. Uh, 
Oh, hi. Oh. Oh, that base, that's fucking gigantic. Payback's a bitch, ain't it? How do you like that, you sons of bitches? Get in close and finish them off. Everybody hold on, gonna be a wild ride. Give him hell, girl. Look out! Woo! Oh boy, oh boy. Ow. Ow. Joker, you okay? No. I think I broke a rib. Or all of them. Multiple core systems overloaded during the crash. Restoring operation will take time. We oh all boy. knew this was likely a one-way trip. I'll do whatever it takes to stop the collectors, but I plan to live to tell about it. I'm glad you're in charge. What's next? How long until the collectors find this landing zone? I do not detect an internal security network. It is possible the collectors do not expect anyone to reach the base. Well, if we're lucky, their external sensors were hit like we were. They might not know we're alive. Okay. This isn't how we planned this mission, but this is where we're at. We can't worry about whether the Normandy can get us home. We came to stop the Collectors, and that means coming up with a plan to take out this station. Edie, bring up your scans. You should be able to overload their critical systems if you get to the main control center here. That means going through the heart of the station, right past this massive energy signature. That's the central chamber. If our crew or any of the colonists are still alive, the Collectors are probably holding them in there. Looks like there are two main routes. Might be a good idea to split up to keep the Collectors off balance, then regroup in the central chamber. No good. Both routes are blocked. See these doors? The only way past is to get someone to open them from the other side. It's not a fortress. There's gotta be something. Here. Maybe we can send someone in through this ventilation shaft. Practically a suicide mission. I volunteer. I appreciate the thought, Jacob, but you couldn't shut down the security systems in time. We need to send a tech expert. It's your call, Commander. Who do we send into the shaft? A tech specialist. tech skills to do this I won't let you down the rest of us will break into two teams and fight down each passage that should draw the collector's attention away from what you're doing I'll lead the second fire team Shepard we'll meet up with you on the other side of the doors not so fast cheerleader nobody wants to take orders from you this isn't a popularity contest lives are at stake Shepard you need someone who can command loyalty through experience Now. Oh no, Jacob. 
Uh, I don't know. Maybe maybe a little. Second fire team leader. Nah. Sorry. That. I. Garrus, you're in charge of the second team. Well, at least he knows what he's doing. Yep. Yeah. yeah, that's why I picked him. I don't know what we're going to find in there, but I won't lie to you. It's not going to be easy. We've lost good people. We may lose more. We don't know how many the collectors have stolen. Thousands, hundreds of thousands. It's not important. What matters is this. Not one more. That's what we can do here today. It ends with us. They want to know what we're made of? I say we show them on our terms. Let's bring our people home. Fuck yeah. All right. You're on the your fire team. All right. Who do I want with me? I want Legion. I want Jack. Do it, Kasumi. And they got Thane backing them up. Good shit. Oh. Inside the ventilation shaft, Shep. It's hot in here, but it's clear. Second team, are you in position? Confirmed. Moving, I'm moving. Something's blocking the pipe. Gotta find a way through that gate up ahead. There is a valve by the ventilation shaft that will likely clear the obstruction. There it goes. Heading through the gate now. Oh, hi, Harbinger. There is, but unfortunately, I'm dealing with Harbinger right now. Focus on Shepard. This hurts you.
Okay. Yep, and I see it. Targeting order process. Working on it. Fuck. Get up, get up, get up, get up. Shut up. I'm fine, I'm fine, don't you worry. Good, you're good. Come in. Look out. Sicker small. We're in position. We need this door open now. Go, we'll cover you. Come on, Kazumi. Something's wrong. I can't get the door open. Ow. I'm in, I'm in, I'm in. Close it, close it, close it, close it. Fall back! Suppressing fire! Don't let anyone through that door! Good job, Kasumi. I knew you wouldn't let me down. Shepard, you need to see this. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. Why is Kasumi in the vents? Because she's a tech specialist? It said tech specialist, so it's like, okay, who's really good? Tali? It says Kasumi or like, I don't know, Morden or Legion? There was options. Looks like one of the missing colonists. Shepard Commander, additional humans. Wait. God. She's still alive. Get her up, get her up. Get them out of there. Hurry. Oh, 
Oh, hey. Hmm. Oh, she is not having a good. No. Shepherd, you came for us. Never been in my crew. No one gets left behind. Thank God you got here in time. A few more seconds, and I don't even want to think about it. The colonists were processed. Those swarms of little robots they melted their bodies into gray liquid and pumped it through these tubes. Whatever the collectors are doing, it ends here. We've done well so far. Let's hope we can finish the job. Joker, can you get a fix on our position? Roger that, Commander. All those tubes lead into the main control room right above you. The route is blocked by a security door, but there's another chamber that runs parallel to the one you're in. I cannot recommend that. Thermal emissions suggest the chamber is overrun with seeker swarms. Morton's countermeasure cannot protect you against so many at once. What about biotics? Could we create a biotic field to keep them from getting near us? Yes, I think it may be possible. I wouldn't be able to protect everyone, but we might be you able send to Jake? get a small team huh. through if they stayed close. I could do it too. In theory, any biotic could handle it. Shepard, who do you want to maintain the field? Uh. Okay, Samara, Jack, Thane, Miranda, Jacob. Uh. Biotic field, and we want the biotic, biotic specialist. Okay, my brain goes Jack or Samara. And experimental. I gotta go with Samara. Yeah. <laughs> Epitism baby, and it's. Yeah, no, like Samara, definitely. Because Jack's wrong, but Sam Samara and I will take a small team through the seeker swarms. The rest of you provide a diversion by going to I always the go with Jack. Passage. We'll open the security doors from the other side and meet you there. Who should lead the diversion team? Uh, diversion team. Hmm. You know what? Garrus already. Uh, you know what? You're right. You're right. He he led the second fire team, so. I I'll keep the defenders busy. You slip around the back. What about me and the rest of the crew, Shepard? We're in no shape to fight. Commander, we have enough systems back online to do a pickup, but we need to land back from your position. We can't afford to go back, Shepard. Not now. Uh Rex isn't It's okay, it's okay. Awesome. You'll never make it without help. I'll send someone with you. Ah, uh, fuck, who do I send? Morton? Okay. I will trust your judgment. Joker, need location of landing zone. We'll meet you there. We've all got our assignments. Let's move out. Okay. Uh, I'm bringing Jack again because she's just an absolute fucking powerhouse. Uh, why is one of the sun? Uh, because that's Morden. But we can't pick him because he's doing the civilian escort. I'll stick with, you know, honestly, I'll stick with Legion and, uh, I'll give him his, uh, yeah, I'm going with the widow and material. Can't pick the other two. In. Yeah. Cause they're doing, uh, their fire team. One's the fire, one's uh, the distraction fire team leader, and one's the biotic specialist. Escort. Try to 
Ja. Yeah. I want Jack for a biotic backup. And Legion because... are interfering with radio contact. You ready for this? <sighs> Let's go, Commander. Incoming. We've been spotted. Oh, you are Harbinger? Okay. Jack, you're okay? Ready to move, Commander. Okay. It's just this thing is so good for armor piercing, especially when I have when you have uh inferno ammo equipped. Hostile engaged. I believe in you, Garrus. There were hostiles. They've seen us. Yeah. Fuck out of here. Oh, Hostile fire. Taking cover. Let me know when you're ready to move. Will do. Yeah, I know my farm's fragile. Ah, for fuck's sakes. Let me know when you're ready to move up, Commander. 
Okay. Okay, we're good. All right, let's go. Let's go. Good on you, Samara. Fucking seeker swarms. I know I didn't have a choice. Let me know when you're ready to move up, come on. Okay, fuck me. Moving up, Commander. And for the final push, Garrison Miranda. Hmm. I have not decided yet. I'm just... Samara I believe in you I can see the entrance we need to get there soon you've almost got it right neutralized Breathe. Hold on. We're almost there. Shepherd, we need to get out of here. All right, let's move. Keep it up. Hurry, Shepherd. Both character not left. Like My boy, Garrus. Joker, are you at the rendezvous point? I'm here, Commander. Chakwas and the rest of the crew just showed up. Morgan's group just arrived, Shepard. No casualties. Oh. Excellent. Now let's make it count. Edie, what's our next step? There should be some nearby platforms that will take you to the main control console. From there, you can overload the system and destroy the base. Commander, you got a problem. Hostile 
A rear guard could defend this position and keep the collectors from overwhelming us. Pick a team to go with you, Shepard. Everyone else can bunker down here and cover your back. Okay, who am I bringing? Okay. Huh. Don't bring Grunt? Why not? Well, the best defending. D that That's fair. Okay, I'm... Then if that's the case, I'll bring. I'm just thinking there. Do I want another really strong? Do I just want like the biotic team? Zaid. Okay. Zaid. Okay. So grunt. Jacob and Zaid are staying. Squish. Okay. Hmm. Insect. Thane? I was either thinking Thane or Legion. He's a drill. Mm. I think, yeah, I'll bring Thane. Uh, no, I'm gonna bring. Th I need a good biotic because uh, if I'm dealing with a lot of like drones and husks, Jack has heavy shockwave and it's gonna help with clearing out like the smaller ads. I've got shockwave too, but having it doubled up, especially for this shit, would is going to be very useful. Got my particle beam. Anything to say before we do this? You do you? Collectors, the Reapers, they aren't a threat to us. They're a but threat to I need Garrus back here to be holding the line. Those are the lines He's an absolute fucking That's demon with that sniper rifle. But I need someone with long range to help us. It's been a long journey, and no one's coming out without scars. But it all comes down to this moment. We win or lose it all in the next few minutes. Make me proud. Make yourselves proud. We'll do our best. Good luck, Shepard. Let's fucking do this. You 
point, that Harbinger is shit. Get fucked. The harbinger is shut the fuck up. Nothing stands against us. No shield. This form is redundant. Ow, ow, ow. Okay, we're okay. This is it. All the tubes lead to this spot. Edie, what can you tell us? What are they doing? The tubes are feeding into some kind of superstructure. It is emitting both organic and non-organic energy signatures. That's terrifying. is an abomination. Edie, how do we destroy it? The large tubes injecting the fluid are a weak structural link. Destroying them should cause the supports to collapse and the Reaper to fall. Give us a minute, Edie. We've got to take care of some old friends first. More of them! Heavies! You harbinger. Shoot the damn tubes. Okay, I got two out of that one. Oh shit. Wait. I was gonna say I don't know. Target 
Come here. Got it. and blow it sky high. Roger that, Commander. Uh, Commander, I've got an incoming signal from the elusive man. He's passing it through. Shepard, you've done the impossible. I was part of a team. Some of them gave their lives for this mission. I know. Their sacrifice will not be forgotten. You did what you had to do, and you acquired the collector base. What? I'm looking at the schematics ED uploaded. A timed radiation pulse would kill the remaining collectors, but leave the machinery and technology intact. This is our chance, Shepard. They were building a Reaper. That knowledge, that framework could save us. What? They liquefied people. Turn them into something horrible. We have to destroy the base. Don't be short-sighted. Our best chance against the Reapers is to turn their own resources against them. They were working directly with the Collectors. Who knows what information is buried there? This base is a gift. We can't just destroy it. No! No matter what kind of technology we might find, it's not worth it. Shepard, you died fighting for what you believed. I brought you back so you could keep fighting. Some would say what we did to you was going too far, but look what you've accomplished. I didn't discard you because I knew your value. Don't be so quick to discard this facility. Think of the potential. No. We'll fight and win without it. I won't let fear compromise who I am. Shepard, think about what's at stake. About everything Cerberus has done for you. You. Thank you, Jack. Let's move. We got ten minutes before the reactor overloads and blows this whole station apart. Inferno ammo. shot.
Oh, I'm an idiot. I just remembered I had the fucking particle beam. Got him. Oh shit. Bane. I got you, bro. Come on. Okay, he's he's just like, oh, that hurt. <laughs> Jack. Yes. Hey, Normandy, good to see you again. Oh, shit. Do it, Joker. Fucking go. I know what I'm gonna do. Oh. Get back to the fucking relay. making a habit of costing me more than time and money. 
You get the help you deserve. And what about the rest of humanity? Your ideals have cost us more than you can imagine. The technology from that base could have secured human dominance in the galaxy, against the Reapers and beyond. Human dominance, or just Cerberus? Strength for Cerberus is strength for every human. Hmm. Fuck you. Cerberus is humanity. No. I should have known you'd choke on the hard decisions. Too idealistic from the start. I'm not looking for your approval. Harbinger's coming and he won't be alone. Humanity needs a leader who's looking out for them. From now on, I'm doing things my way, whether you agree or not. Don't turn your back on me, Shepard. I made you. I brought you back from the dead. And I'm going to do exactly what you brought me back to do. I'm going to win this war, and I'll do it without sacrificing the soul of our species. Uh... Cerberus puts itself as a pro-humanity organization, but they're also absolutely psychotic. Think kind of a, a less, uh, almost on par with the Umbrella Corporation. No, like Subject Zero, Jack. She was literally a result of Cerberus experiments to fuck with people's genetic biotic shit. As in, like, torture. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is Mass Effect 2. And those, Akko, were the Reapers. All right. And oh, I have all the ships. Yay. And I got a perfect on the suicide mission. And ladies and gentlemen, that is the end of Mass Effect 2. Probably soon, probably tomorrow, I will be starting Mass Effect 3. The final 
Uh, and just as a heads up, we will not be playing Andromeda. But thank you all for being here. This has been a lot of fun. Mass Effect 2 is done.